Testing microphone, one two. Trying to capture game. Four. Duchess Matilda. Hey. Okay, game seems all right. Everything okay. Where do I start over here? It's cold down, I guess. Anyways, welcome back to the channel, welcome back to uh, CK3. Gonna try uh, expanding on the uh, acquisitions we made last stream. Uh, we did continue uh, the entire campaign this weekend just to try it out the game and we learned a hell of a lot. But we're just uh, continuing it from where we left it off on Friday because that's only fair for the viewers who were watching uh, the previous stream. Anyways, we started out as Tuscany and Matilda di Canossa from House Canossa, <laughs> of course. And uh, we set ourselves with an opening uh, goal just to learn the game. I always do it like this. You just set yourself a goal, preferably a hard one for me, and then just try living up to that goal while learning the game. And we were like, yeah, she's a diplomat. She needs to marry matrilineally in order to uh, start a dynasty, otherwise it's game over. She starts with game over screen if you don't get an heir. So, uh, an heir in uh, matrilineal Good luck. And uh, what we were seeing is that Mr. Lombardy over there, Mr. King over there, was uh, quite old, and Mr. Primary Heir over there, Duke Wealth of Tuscany, was is actually lustful at the start in 1066. So I was like, yeah, okay, let's. Uh, we basically, uh, yeah, yeah, we be starting with the Tuscan Bachelorette indeed. The Tuscan Bachelorette was like, yeah, the goal we set ourselves is uh, to inherit Lombardy without it splitting up. 
well, not not with with her, of course, but but to secure the Dikanasa dynasty actually uh, lives on through uh, Lombardy hobby and uh, that the children will inherit Lombardy. Was it on? I don't know. Is it on? Yes. Be I thought it was impossible to be honest, but yeah. We uh, restarted a couple times We uh, to learn the game and then we figured it out what to do. We had to uh, basically go for the primary heir, romance him, became our soulmate. We invited him and his wife to court. Because, yeah, he starts married. Then we killed off his wife. And uh, we actually married him. Uh, matrilineally. While he was in our court. And after we romanced him into our being our soulmate. And he's still the primary heir. So uh, any children that we're going to get. Which we already have, by the way. We do already have a kid. Did a big Deaconasse. They were married matrilineal, so is it of my dynasty, and he will inherit, uh, at the moment, entire uh, Lombardy. If the king doesn't get any more uh, heirs, that is, but yeah, then we'll just kill him off. Let me just check this file, what we were doing. Gotta murder the other kids, all done already, man, all done already. All done already. So yeah, no hostile schemes, no personal schemes. Okay. Sure. Hmm. Here you are. Now what? Here we are. Seems like we're in some sort of uh, wars from our liege. I don't really care. So yeah, what to do now? I suppose we could... Uh, I don't know. Killing off the king is a bit... Eh? How old is his wife? Can she still get children? 18. Oh my god. So in t yeah, we killed we killed off both of the the brothers from the main heir of uh, Lombardy or uh, the main uh, heir from uh, Lombardy already. But I should prevent her from uh, spawning another devil spawn female, so, uh, male. I mean, so I don't know. We also um, should be trying to uh, get ourselves into other uh, stuff here. Like, for example, marry you. Matrilineally, but how the hell do you do that? Hmm. Oh, 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 I, I see opportunity here. We could marry one of the brothers matrilineally, maybe. Or did we already? No. Oh, well, let me check this. Maybe we could fabricate a hook. Oh man, this game can be complicated when you focus on the skull degree. So yeah, uh not CMAC wealth. As long as you can manage to be positivity beauty. Yeah, right to rule to each their own place now. I, I I'm just a, a, an idiot here, trying out the game. I know you, you should be trying to, to create a very good bloodline with good traits. But what I'm trying to learn here is to inherit titles by aggressively marrying and skulldunging everybody out of my way so that my grandkids are actually inheriting all the titles. So that we get land for free, basically. Is it uh, a good idea or not? Not really sure. We'll see. So, does he accept? He accepts matril... Ah, oh, he doesn't. Wait, what? Ah, oh, matrilineal marriage minus thousand. So... Basically, oh wait a minute! Wait, 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 wait. Yeah, but here's the brother. Why don't you, huh? Did you go into diplomacy for better marriages? Nope. We're just looking at the. Uh, I'm looking at the duchies, and I'm trying to marry and murder my way into inheriting their titles at the moment. That's what we are focusing on. We actually uh, married the the main heir of Lombardy and got all got got all of his brothers out of the way. So uh, and we already got a male kid. So we'll inherit that title in the end. But now I'm looking slowly but steadily. I'm not the kind of player that rushes. To uh, I, I'm gonna yeah wait 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 wait. What exactly do th there must be some sort of an Italy title here? Sicily and. Car 
Croatia? Sicily and Croatia are brought back under the jour. Yeah, but no. Ah, oh, there's a kingdom of Italy and an em yeah, and, yeah. I'm I'm still a bit confused when it comes to the titles, really. So yeah, okay. Ah, uh, yeah. First things first. I'm gonna pin me some characters here. I also should take... Oh my god, the Byzantine Empire already has his greedy fingers on... Uh... Okay, kingdom titles. Ah, there we go, Italy. Okay, so I, I basically do need... Yeah, but what, what exactly do I need to get the title? How does it say that? Uh what? Eight uh, oh, so you need more than half of the counties required. Gotcha, we're learning. So basically if I inherit if I inherit um Um I'm 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 Oh man, I, that's so annoying. Two duchy titles and five on the cash. Yeah, okay. So so that's what I thought. How the fudge do I get it back to normal? Ah, there. Return back to... So if I inherit Lombardy, I can create Italy title, right? Okay. Well, sure. Sorry for not unpausing, but I'm just trying to get my bearings here. How many kids did... We, we only got daughters so far. One, one was uh, an illegitimate one that got legitimized, but that she was married... She was actually born before we uh, signed Matrilineal, so she's of the uh, my hubby's dynasty. Yeah, Matilda, man. Ireland is for... Uh, uh, Ireland... Uh, nah, I just didn't want to play Ireland. And I think Matilda is a good alternative. So we got some daughters to marry off. Yeah, we got some daughters to marry. I'm going to try marrying into, I don't know, Savoy or Piedmont or, or whatever. What happens with Piedmont? Oh, so if I kill this kid, then this guy. So kill him off, then I guess, and then try marrying into Savoy, right? Huh? We are skull though. We, we, we're just gonna do it. Ninety-five percent. Oh sure, you're so dead, kid. Up. No, no regrets. We focusing on on skull dagging Matilda here. So yeah, sure. Now I need to get my greedy fingers some way, somehow, into uh, marrying. Okay. Um. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Uh. How, how do you see your own character's uh, focus again? Uh Ah, skull dog refocus. Gotcha. Yeah, what I was wondering, what exactly can you do with kidnappings? This is something that is really intriguing me. I was like, yeah, if you 100%, if you capture a male ruler, or any ruler of a nation while you're at war, you get 100%, right? So, what if you capture some ruler? Before you do a war and then start a war, do you get immediately 100%? That, that can't be, that can't be, that would be too fudging broken. But oh well, it's likely working that way. But yeah, can you actually use ran, uh, uh, do a ransom to accept matrilineal marriage on a kid? What I'm wondering is, I don't know the numbers yet. So if I get a strong hook on Duke de Valerian. On Duke Remond or, 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 or anybody, would he agree to actually let his daughter or brother be married? Oh, oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute, chat. I could marry off my kid to one of the daughters.
You can capture as the war is ongoing. Oh, okay. Kidnap heirs, give them land, press their claims. What? Why would I kidnap somebody and then give them land? Well, that sounds a real th th that sounds cheesy enough because I don't understand it. But okay. Some abducting some you can grant them land without abducting, right? Ah oh, well, I'm not entirely sure. But yeah, anyways. Ah, uh, Sicily is kind of lost, I guess. Apulia, I would want to get my greedy fingers into also. But yeah, seeing that Savoy and Piedmonte are actually being ruled by two kiddos, is I'm go I'm gonna kill off Piedmonte's uh, ruler so that it goes on the Savoy, and then I'm gonna marry. No, oh, we're just gonna do it. She's five years old. She's ten years old. And she's unmarried. Well, I would have to... Now, wait a minute. My son and heir, eh? Does she... Don't he accept... Oh, wait. No, not matrilineal. Derp. <laughs> Somebody's been calling me on a foreign number for like ages. They are related and there is a ch Wait, how are they related? Are Savoy's related to Canossa? Oh, this seems like a good move for me, man. This is my, my, my... I will continue as this character. If I marry him off... Okay, if this guy dies, Duke Falerin... And if I then kill off his uh, his brother Rayman over here, then it would go all go to an yes, right? Or would I have to kill a statue also? Scratching my head here. Well, it's always better to marry the younger daughter then, because I gotta kill them both anyways. Otherwise, you might not. Making babies is a bit risky. Yeah, that's why I'm looking at the statue over here, Nooster. I'm still having on pause in the start of the stream because, yeah, I want to do it long term. I'm the kind of player also in EU4 that thinks very, very, very long term. Marrying her doesn't seem like a bad idea if I can make, if I can make uh, Piedmont fall on the Savoy, right? I would inherit all of it. Sounds like fun. And I'm already in line with Duke Raymond. If the uh, the other guy dies to inherit the title of Lombardy. So, yeah, sure. This looks like a great idea. And then I'm going to look at Apulia also. Hmm. How's Apulia's situation when it comes to... Uh... You know what we could do? I could romance the air... After the king in uh, after the king in Lombardy dies, then kill off my own hubby, romance this guy, create a kid and inherit the time. <laughs> We're just gonna do that. Oh, that that's that's fun. So to recapitulate, you're gonna fall on the Duke for Levin and we're, we're murdering him. And you you're five years old. Now you're thinking with CK3. Oh, I love this part of the game, Nooster. I love this part of the game. I think it's one of the hardest things to grasp what I'm doing here. I don't think the combat or whatnot is that hard in CK3. Or to understand stuff. But but yeah, basically, I think I am going to just bloody marry this guy, man. Uh, Estashi de Savoie. <sighs> Let me try to think here. So, if you die... It's gonna fall on the Duke Raymond. If Duke Raymond dies, it's gonna go to Agnes. If Agnes dies, it's gonna go to Astashi. But yeah, what I'm wondering, how does it work if you got two females, chat? Do, does it get split between the two females, or does it only go to the oldest female? I think uh, the, the, it'll get split between the daughters, right? Oh well, she's 10 years old. We're just gonna bloody marry her. Why not? You can look at the title to see the air list. 
What? Yeah, I've been trying to figure that one out. I'm, I'm doing it manually here. Look at the title, you say. Uh... How? Ah, I see what you mean. So, du German Agnes Eustache. Okay. So, see, Eustache, the one we're trying to marry is third in line. Okay, so she's just third in line. So, I was right. Marrying her and killing off the other two will make sure that any kid that my primary heir makes in like, I don't know, 10 years, 15 years? That, that Matilda of Tuscany were just role-playing it. She's trying to install grandkids on all of the thrones next to her. Oh well. So is Tashi. I'm just gonna marry her, man. This seems like a great idea. My son and heir? There. We'll accept. And I'm, I'm actually gonna get an alliance with, uh... Oh, I've been trying to think about that also. So, if Astashi actually takes the throne... No, oh, there. Right, um, also... I kind of wanted a ward for my... Uh... Let me check it out. We got other stuff to do here. Uh, find a character. I've been looking at the traits and I think uh, stewardship might have touched. We got a knight I saw to marry off. Uh, if I'm doing something wrong, then by all means. But but yeah, I want to get a education for my kid from like the highest possible. Uh, it cannot be a ruler. They won't come to my court. I'm pretty sure female is always better. And anybody who's unmarried. Right? Then just take a look at the sending. You are crazy good man. 23 and 7? Okay, I'm gonna marry you off to one of my knights. Why not? Then she'll come to court and then we can make her the ward of the kid, right? Add diplomacy range? Oh, hi there, Spirit Baker. Yeah, but see, I already got diplomacy range. Yeah, but it doesn't matter. To, what is diplomatic? What is diplomatic range even about? If I marry her to one of my knights, she will come to court, right? Well, I can make her my 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 war, my 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 thingamajigger. So yeah. Oh wait a minute. I think this guy. She is Saxon culture, isn't she? Yeah, I can't lick Saxon. Oh yeah, that's a perfect couple, chat. That's a perfect couple, man. You can't interact with characters that far away. It says I can marry them. So there, my knight is also Saxon. That'll make a lovely couple, man. 36 and uh, 39. Yeah, sure. Marry my knight. Uh, well, Spirit Baker, I think you're wrong here, mate. I, I can do it. She will come to court. That's, this is one of my courtiers, so he's unmarried. She will come to court. No matter if she's out of diplomatic range, don't care. Okay, take the hand of my courtier in holy matrimony. Main said bitches bless our union. Gotcha. So now I kind of want. Uh... Hey, what? Oh yeah, okay. So my kid is, uh, is gonna be betrothed to Astashi. Wait, what? I already. How do I get an alliance already now? I thought it only happened if the ruler took the throne. Uh yeah, but we were busy with with Ward. Uh, I want to make. Did a big over here. Uh, it is educate child, right? No. How do I change it? Do I change character? Yeah, she's a, she's at court. I was right. Okay. She's in diplomatic... Oh, okay. So I gotta set it to diplomatic range. Otherwise, I can't marry them off. Is that what you're saying? Okay, gotcha. Gotcha. And she's 39, man. We just touch monthly stewardship lifestyle experience. Somebody with... Yeah, okay. Become my ward. 
Attempt to convert Didabig... <laughs> no! Become li Yeah, okay, that's a great warden, man. Do it. Anytime you marry a close relative to the close relative of a ruler, the lines is made automatically. Ah, okay. Nice. So, Didabig Dikanasa Bikig's ward. So yeah, how does wardship work? I was just assuming, yeah, we need somebody with high stewardship, with, with like crazy good stewardship, uh, like me just touched. But what will happen now? The war Does the warden have, have like uh, a chance to give attributes to the kid? Can me just touched actually go over to the kid? I don't know, man. We'll, we'll see, but I think Mrs. Uh, what she was called... Lisa and Slagle is going to be a good warden for our kid. What else can we do now? We're we're killing off you. Ah, uh, think out, uh, think. Let me see the issues. Increase opinion. Increase Emperor Heinrich's opinion of me. Well, sure. Why not? Not entirely sure why you would why I would want high. But, oh well. I can lawfully imprison the Countess. She's a fornicator. Why would I ever want to do that? Ah, uh, maybe if it's unruly vassals or something. Oh yeah, something I've been wondering, chat. What exactly... Is it a bad thing to actually give powerful vassals nothing on your council? I want a good powerful council. I'm sick and tired of my crappy... Uh, last stream I gave all my powerful vassals a council position. But they're all crap! And, I'm, and I've been getting the worst possible events for them. So, how bad is it if you... if you, For example, if I would find some females... Yeah, Nooster, I'm trying to... I'm trying to... Oh, man. Educate me! That's what I wanted to ask. If I just go for a council that is like made up of the best possible people around, the youngest best possible people around, and then grant them titles, would they become powerful vassals? What exactly happens if you don't give the powerful vassals a council position? If it's just an opinion debuff, I don't care, I think. But yeah, since we're form, I want to first and foremost get a better spy master. Why not? Right? So, uh, let me see. Find the character. Character finder. I want uh, the same thing. What is a good... Yeah, wait. Is there actually a good trait that, that has to do with uh, Skullduggery Chuck? Uh, I don't know. But anyways. Sword by Intrigue skill. I, I should probably get a cat like from from within diplomatic range, right? So is diplomatic range? L let me read that. When you get kingdom side, you actually start to care with powerful. Yeah, but could you elaborate on that? What is actually the p the, the downside of not giving your your vassals uh, land? Powerful vassals, uh, council position. I mean. You can only interact who are within diplomatic range, however, neighboring realms are always in range. Okay, so do it inside. Um, I don't know if he got a female to marry off still. Anyways, um, it'll only be the Christian ones now, right? Independence Wars. Oh, okay. Well, that's not good then. Yeah, but there's one... There's can I not, like, give new vassals land chat and make them the powerful ones and, and then just let the other ones die off? <sighs> okay. 26 intrigue. Oh, my God. Mantri intrigue lifestyle. Ex oh, my God. Wolfhild over here is crazy good. But she's a courtier already. Gotcha. Paranoid. Enemy personal... Wait a minute. Deceitful. To lie... Oh, I like her. To lie and deceive is in Wolfhild's nature. Diligence. Okay, Nooster, that is a... But, but yeah, do I have a point in making really good... P 
people just my vassal? Really young, powerful people like a new knight at my court who has crazy high, uh, crazy high, uh, marshal and then just make him my marshal on the council and then just give him land and let the other one sod off. Intricate web weaver is plus 30. Elusive shadow is, uh, well, uh, she is 27. Okay, 27 sounds like a good spy master for me, man. So, uh, can I marry her off to somebody? But she's already a courtier, and she is actually not. I don't think she will accept marriage if she, if she is, uh... Filippo, my courtier. Oh, she does actually go. She wants to come, she wants to leave her court. Oh, wait a minute. Um, okay, chat. Will she come... Will she come immediately to my court? Or is it only if Filippo actually becomes of age and when's the actually... Betrothed and I don't want. She will not... She will not abandon her court yet, right? Uh, am I hearing a flood of whining and seeing all people play it? Yeah, I, from what I've heard, CK3 is pretty darn good. But yeah, can can anybody ask a question? If you arrange a marriage for somebody with an underrate, Betrothed doesn't make her come to the court already, right? Nah, I, I don't think so. So maybe I should take the second one. Yeah, wait a minute. The second one, what am I even on about? You have to wait for the marriage for her to come. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, but I don't have anybody to marry off anymore. So so maybe... Uh, do we have enough knights already? Yeah, we do have enough knights. Uh, okay. Uh, are they all married? No. Vassal and knights. Okay, can I invite you to court? Wait, what? You're already at court. Then why can't I... Why can I not marry you off? Eglable courtiers and vassals. Oh, man. Uh, okay. No, well, I'm, I'm, I'm going to check it out. Maybe I just didn't find... He is a mayor. He can marry a noble. Oh, gotcha. But I was right trying to find a mayor. Okay. What about... So he got married to the, to the ward we had. What about you? He's 34. Not sure. Arrange them. Find the spas. Yeah, but what's the difference between two characters at my own court? No, 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 no. Find the spas. Uh. Wait, what? So. Oh my god. Why do I have to do it all? What? Why is this different than the other one? So, not ruler. Nah, okay, I'm gonna do it the other way around. Because this is just getting stupid. Ah. Uh, on character, diplomatic change. Yeah, anybody. So, I, I want to get her, basically. So, arrange the marriage. Huh? Why can't I not marry off my knights, chat? I only got one courtier that I can marry off. Find spouse, not arranged marriage. But what's the goddamn difference? <laughs> oh well, fine. I'll, I'll do it the I'll do it the way we were looking at. So he is married already. Uh, Flavio the knight. Find the spas. I oh, shoot and I forgot her name. Darn it. Uh, does anybody remember her name? Shoot, man. Ah, it was... Ah, wait. Ah, okay. Sure. 27, that's her, right? Okay. Send the proposal. Uh, 
Uh, tyranny of Duke Raymond? I'm not married to Piedmont, am I? I don't get it. What? How am I allied to... How am I allied to Piedmont? I didn't do anything with these guys. I think? Oh, well, sure. <laughs> Whatever, but I, I can't forget what I was... Uh, what I was doing. So yeah, I sure now assign her the new one as uh, my new spine monster. Don't care what else, whatever everybody thinks. So yeah, now we got a really good spy monster, and I'm gonna well disrupt schemes, find secrets. I I'll. Mm, If you got 95 on most of our schemes to murder it, well, I'll put it on uh, support. Anyways. So, wh what is this war about? Huh? Which one is it? <laughs> right? Err. Ah, okay. Well, sure then. Let's go to war! Um, select the army, the commander. Okay. Uh, sure, I guess. Do we have... Ah, we got a seed specialist. Uh, sure. And anyways, uh, Monferrado. Okay, send him there. What? Come on, gate. I selected it. I want you to go there. What? Why can I not do this? Game, please. Don't start annoying me. Go there. What am I doing wrong? Oh, it's left. Okay, never mind. It's the other key that I thought. Anyways. Right. So, uh... I suppose I cannot change out the bishop, right? Oh. Fabricate a claim on a county. Yeah, that's what something I would want. Rome, I kind of should declare war for sooner rather than later. Um, what do I want? Pisa, I guess? Sure. I should start some, some war, uh, wars also. Anyways, uh, what else council positions do we have? Oh my god, the Chancellor only has five diplomacy, seriously. Do we have anybody who is quite good at this? Sixteen. He's my guest, but yeah. 16 is not bad. I I think I read on the wiki that anything above 15, you don't get negative events. <sighs> also crap. Hmm. Well, chat told me that if you're not a kingdom, that it doesn't really matter if you got people that are uh, powerful vassals and not getting a court. So, uh, should we do the same thing again, chat? Just marry off a knight, find a, find a good female with, that is young with good diplomacy? How many knights can we still marry off? I mean, I wouldn't mind a consul made up of people who married my knights. So, Flavio got married. He's a con, so I'm assuming he can't uh, get married anymore. Right? He ha oh, he does one. Oh, he has one already. So we don't have any knights. No. Oh well. Ah, uh, shoot, man. 
let me see. You can recruit, but it costs money. Okay. Yeah, but I want to get the best people. Is it worth it at the start, if you're tiny still, that it's... Uh, is it worth it to actually go for the highest people and not give a damn about your powerful vessels? So, uh, let me see. Diplomatic range inside, ruler not ruler, gender female. Well, it doesn't really matter, I suppose, if I can invite them to court. Right? 22 diplomacy. Now we're talking... Uh, do you get bad stuff? He's an Italian one. If you look at the night list, there are also random waters. If you pay them, they will join the court. Can be worthwhile if they're talented. Well, okay, sure. And then just then just get a female, right? Okay, fine, chat. Let's do that. There are also random wanderers. If you random wanderers. I only see guests so far. Uh, six prowess, that's not much. Nine prowess? Okay, sure. Pay to employ Goswin as your courtier. Okay, let's do it then. Ten, ten bucks! Ten bucks! That's nothing. Okay, fine. Let's marry us some knights. No, no more gusts. Okay. Fine. Uh, find the spouse, and now we're gonna go for the highest. Yeah, w which is the hi the most important council positions, man? Ah, uh, so sure. She's a Norse woman with 22 diplomacy, but I want somebody young. Um, can you can you sort it on on two things? She's 28, 21. Okay, 21. Wait, Bodo and Dochter van Gent. She's only 16 years old. You would make, and she's Dutch. Spy master. We already got a really good spy master. So there. Okay, that's going to become our... I, I don't give a damn what my vassals are going to think about it. I want the best possible council around. Right. And, uh... Robert, we're also going to find you a spouse. Uh, Stuart, right? He can push development. Okay. Let me find somebody that is uh, really young and really good in stewardship. 29, 19. Well, I could actually... If she's good in diplomacy... Well, she's not bad either, man. 33 is not that bad. And she ha... Do I need to look at the traits also? Not really. Uh, th do the traits matter for council positions? I suppose yes. Ah, uh, generous, stubborn... Is there really nobody really young but, but decent? No. Nobody that is like 16 years old. Oh well, then we'll just pick the top one. Spy master can be a... F yeah, wait a minute. Can, can you appoint everybody... Can you appoint females on all the positions, chat? Or does the... Uh, can I make her my steward? Can you make anybody on, on the council a female? Most? No. Oh, shoot. Right. Well, thanks for warning me, then. Thanks for warning me. So, steward. Yeah, it seems you can only do males. <laughs> well, thanks. Uh, thanks for letting me know. So, ruler, not ruler. Yeah, wait, no, this is only looking inside court. So it needs to, it has to be a male then, right? For steward and for, uh, for this position. Well, 14 is not that bad, but oh well. Let me find somebody. Oh, come on, do I really always have to look in court window if I want to find somebody? Never mind. So gender male then, I guess? Not ruler, unmarried. I don't really 
know if they have to be unmarried, but let me check. So, stewardship, let me see. 22 and 10 Castilian unmarried. Okay. Why does this not work? He is the Leech Knight and he's on the council. Okay, so wait a minute. I have to find somebody who's not a courtier then. He's a guest. 22 and 11 diplomacy. This guy could also be a very good... Uh, and he's made his touch. Oh, he could, he could ward one of my children also. Wait, wh why can I not invite these guys? What's the difference? But why can I not give him 10 gold here? Base reluctance minus 50. What's the difference with doing it? I don't get it. Ah, because he was a guest, no doubt. The other ones were guests, and this one is just... Okay, uh, arrange the marriage then. Don't care. Yeah, I couldn't... Um... Hmm... Has to be a female. Yeah, I don't. I, I want to get him now. It's easier to hire somebody in Tuscany. Okay, fine. Let me check it. Find the character. Um. How do you do that? Ah, do I? Should I put it on Latin group? Let me take a look at that one. That's 19 stewardship and also... Uh, oh, wait, no, it's not. Stewardship plus 8. Oh, okay. Alberto is 21 years old. Well, sure, but only 60. So you're telling me that these guys... No, it's the same exact thing, man. Base reluctance minus 50. What? <laughs> For the love of God. Yeah, I don't get this. What do I have to put it on? Italians, then? Why do they want to come to my court? <laughs> nope. So I gotta basically marry somebody, uh, find him a wife, otherwise he won't come. That's so weird, man. Do I need any more females? I could marry... Is there any other console position I can install a female on? Uh, oh wait, I can decide you, right? So we got a female really good intrigue spy master. And I suppose you have to be... Wait, what? You can... Well, 14 I suppose is not that bad, right? I just want to get somebody uh, better than you. Plus 10 is good. Yeah, okay, see you, I top. I read on the wiki that anything above plus 15 is not giving you the bad events. But oh well, maybe I'm wrong. Uh, is this the guy I got to court? To, to become my steward? Ah, okay, so this one, yeah, that one, uh, Goswin was likely the one that was going to be the Chancellor. Most important one is steward and needs to be 15. Gotcha, chat. Thank you. Why did I get you? I don't think I get... I, I don't understand why, why some people... Well, he's 20 years old and he has 16 in diplomacy. I suppose I'll just pick you. He's 20 years old. I could even give him a... Whatever. There. Now, what, what can we put it on? Domestic affairs. Can also stack steward in my spas. Should chance assist ruler to stewardship. Oh, well, we've done that already. 
Anyways, I need to find a really good steward, and it seems like it can only be, uh... What the hell? I thought I just looked for somebody that was good in stewardship. Oh well. Guess not. Yeah, the, the, the entire recruiting characters is kind of, uh, eh. So I need to, Oh, no, I think I needed to find a female, right? Diplomatic range, uh, and it needed to be... Try abducting a high staff person. Oh, I like the way you think. Anyways, uh, high stewardship. Yeah, wait a minute. We got somebody with high stewardship, but yeah, but that was a female. It has to be a male, don't it? I should have uh, tried marrying off somebody. Can you be a warden on the consulate once? I, I, I didn't find it a female to ward my, my kid. Shoot. Oh, well. Me to touch. You would be really great. 28. Not sure. So can I... Oh, for the love of God. He is on the council. And I don't have anybody to marry off to him. How do I get somebody to marry off to him? Can, can I, like, look at guests? Any female and they just uh, say, Yeah, come on in. Has a useful county claim. And she's 73. Candida Greedy. Uh, okay. So recruit the court and marry her off, right? Why not? And uh, I, I hope I'm doing it okay here. Right, so not ruler unmarried. Uh, anybody do is in stewardship and young. Meet is touched. Marry her matrilineally or she will leave. Really now? What does that matter? Okay, I didn't know that, but thanks anyways. Arrange the marriage to Candida. Matrilineal. She I will not accept. Uh, what is it? Wives usually go to live with their husbands, not the other way around. Yeah, but no, Nooster. She is my courtier. He will come to my court, not the other way around, right? He's a steward of somebody else, and I can actually snatch him from this guy if I marry her, uh... If... She will go to live with him if it's not matrilineal. What? Seriously? But I did it! Okay, well, sh sure, I'll believe you. I'll believe you then. So basically, I gotta find somebody that is not a courtier with somebody else, then that will accept matrilineal line, uh, matrilineal thingamajig. That's what you're telling me, right? So he's a courtier. He's already a marshal. That's not great. Oh, wait, no. It was these guys. 33. Ah, uh, are you? He's a guest of Erland. Yeah, he will accept matrilineal, no doubt. Okay, this works. He accepts matrilineal. So she would be, uh... So Gerald Fitz Thingamajigger is gonna be our new, uh... He's gonna be our new steward then. Oh, uh, I'm trying to do it alright. So, Con Vitale, I'm so sorry. But we got somebody 22-ish stewardship. And young. It will do it. Um, what county should you develop always, chat? I, I, I will develop it. Is the capital always good? Do you get increase development by one? Building construction time minus 27. So do you just do it on everything? And keep it going forever? We'll start with the capital in Firenze, I suppose. Two years left. You're fabricating a claim. What can you make? Assigned to domestic affairs. I'm just trying to, to understand all these buttons. Ah, uh, foreign affairs. 
prestige plus 8 a month or direct vassal opinion up to plus 8 yeah don't really care we'll, we'll leave it at that what can the marshal do organize levies man at arms or increase control in the county i'm assuming that's only if you conquer somebody right uh-huh so uh, and support schemes i suppose find secret is useful if i wanna I might actually do it on a pool, yeah. Why not? We want to get married into that. So sure. Why not? So the console is A-OK. -okay. I'm assuming I can't actually... I can't actually fire this guy. Endorses me. Ah, so you gotta keep this guy at plus one or better than I'm assuming. Endorsing... Since Sancho Pena is, is plus one or greater, you gain levies and taxes from his church holdings. Okay, so you, you gotta always keep and get your uh, leech council. Uh, oh. He's 37. Should I install a marshal that is better than this guy, chat? 14 is not that bad, right? Train commanders. Well, we could check somebody if uh, if anybody would hide. Marshal would be willing to come to my court. Twenty-seven marshal. What? Get a doctor. Yo, first thing. One thing at a time, Newster. I'm sorry if I'm going slow. One thing at a time. I'm. Uh, I guess. Uh, does it matter if you... Yeah, okay. You would be a great marshal. He's actually only 27 years old. So I need to get any female and... and uh, uh, any female and marry her off, right? What other females could I... Yeah, a doctor. Maybe I could find a doctor first, a female one, and then marry off a new marshal to her. Okie dokie. Uh, let's try that. So what traits would a good doctor need? I'm assuming learning and, and maybe a... I don't know, herbalist? Does that exist? Yeah, herbalist. Character is well versed in herbs, botany, and medical practices related to plants. That sounds like the best possible trait for a healer. Correct me if I'm wrong. Sword by learning skill. And uh, I want a female. Thank you very much. So, sure. Courtier, no. Courtier, no. He's a guest. He's a guest. 18 learning, which he's 30 years old. Me. Hmm. Ah, oh, I can marry her to my chancellor. Okay. It's physician? Yeah, but isn't herbalist also good then, chat? Fair enough, I'm willing to do physician. Uh, is it, can, can they have both? Physician. Ah, okay. Renowned physician. Disease resistance, huge boost. This character's healing skill are well known in scholarly circles. Okay. So, dead in. Guest of Count Rodrigo. Okay. Arrange a marriage, and I could marry her to my counselor. Sure. Uh, he's at my court already, so I don't need matrilineal, right? It doesn't matter then. Okay. So you will become court physicians. If I'm doing something horribly wrong, then by all means do tell me, chat. Candida is now a member. Wait, was it her? Who was the fur? No. Wait a minute, what? Yeah, but wait, chat. She only has one learning. So do the traits matter more? Who the hell are you?
Didn't I just hire somebody else? What the hell? Um, I don't get it. <laughs> right, uh, let me, anyways. There's a delay in events, that was an earlier one. Ah, okay. Robert, ah, so, so they didn't accept the marriage yet. Okay, okay, so do I gotta wait in until, the, until she accepts the marriage, is that it? I don't get it, I could have sworn I hired somebody. Anyways, we'll do kidnapper. Yeah, but uh, I'm confused here. Huh? Look at my court, she will be there. Ah, okay, gotcha, chat. Uh, don't love a gun. Oh, wait, that's guest. Court here, court here, court here. Who the hell was it? It was her ma it was her hobby, yeah. Imoke, that's her. That's her. Yeah, renowned physician, astute intellectual. You we would make a fine court physician, I would say. Okay. So we've got all our positions uh accounted for now, I would say. Uh, is there anything I forgot? Well, better mar- was I gonna get a better marshal? I don't remember anymore. <laughs> yeah, my knight is actually better. But yeah, then he can't lead armies anymore if I put him on the console, right? I think I was actually looking at somebody... And a character. No. And. It was some Polish guy. Wasn't there some goddamn Polish guy? Ah, oh, no, it was a male. Never mind. Yeah, you. So, how can I get you at court? 27, Marshall. That's just insane. And he's only 24. Arrange a marriage. With. Oh, there's once again nobody, of course. Uh -huh. Hmm. So, uh, can you not invite people to court as a guest and then recruit them? I just don't understand that you can pay guests ten bucks and that's it. But people who don't want to—is there any sort of thing you can do to actually make them come to your court? <sighs> I'm not gonna romance him. I could abduct him. <laughs> you can get a hook on him. Yeah, but what, what if I... I could, can I abduct this guy and make him my warden uh, to release him, chat? Yeah, Alifi, I don't care. Yes, you can abduct him. Okay, sure. Abduct him then. Why not? Oh, murder Duke Raymond. Oh, okay. Well, fine. Fine. Well, I suppose we'll keep our coat here. Right, so we, we did a hell of a lot already micromanaging our, our stuff. Wait, what? Duke Raymond is disposed? B -b 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 the guy got <laughs> likely the guy got captured in battle or something uh, what the hell Piedmonte vanished and Savoy got it all well that that's 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 great that's exactly what we wanted then I don't need to actually murder yeah wait a minute now, now I'm getting confused here so we are married to a stash yeah, my, my main playable guy, the next guy, is you? Yeah, this is great. We just we just get Piedmont for free then. Okay, sure. Thanks th thanks for losing that war. Oh, I like it. This is great. Alliance invalid. I didn't want you anyway. 
Raymond de Savoie because he's no longer a ruler. Air. I still don't understand exactly what happened there. Did Savoy win a war against Piedmont and then just annex it? You can request an alliance. No, 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 no. We, we married ourselves, my, my main kid, my main male in line, to Estasia de Savoie. And we're, we're killing off both of these to make sure that, that she, whenever she comes of age, that my. That the, the grandson of uh, Matilda will be my dynasty and in line to inherit Savoy completely. Or Savoy completely. That's what we're trying to do here. What about Provence? Let, let me just stretch out my, my, my grasp even further. Uh, she only has... He has only one kiddo. Geoffred Bossenid. What if I... Hmm... He's unmarried. Okay. But I don't think he will marry my daughter. He's eight years old. I don't think he will marry my daughter's matrilineally, right? No, he doesn't. He will not accept. Okay. So what can you do to enforce matrilineal marriage on somebody? Is it possible to abduct the king? The leech, so to speak, and then force a matrilineal down his throat? I don't think so. Hmm. So I, what I could do is wait until he gets another kid. Abduct him, recruit him, force him to marry. Wait, what? You mean the primary heir, then I'm assuming. Right? You mean abduct the primary heir? Recruit him, force him to marry. That's very interesting. And then just release him. You can't recruit a ruler. Okay, chat. Thanks. Thanks. But yeah, we're, we're kind of busy with Savoy here first. Savoy. Anyways. Um, so, right. Um, 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 um. What was I going to do? Yeah, the Pope. Can I kill the Pope? <laughs> I mean, can I... Uh, can I declare for Rome now? Yes, we could. You need a strong hook to force matrilineal. You can use a hook on his... Yeah, but... Okay, fair enough. Um, Similar troops. Oh, I don't really like that. And I don't have allies that I can... That I can call... I, I don't know, man. I would want to make Rome... I don't want the AI... I want Rome to be my capital, but I don't want the AI to make stupid stuff in there, like, like stupid buildings. But I think for Rome we gotta wait. I don't know. You tell me. Should I wait? To the Pope likely... He has no allies, but I think he has crazy amounts of money. He would just hire anybody and... Uh... Oh. So I suppose... Uh... Wait, what? Ah, pregnant. Merc, hell yeah, that's what I thought. Uh, the merchant presents me with an ex exquisite carpet in the hopes of good future relations. Wouldn't a carpet like this muffle the treading of feet, even conceal the steps of a bumbling agent? Wait, what? Oh, that's for that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the guy that I'm trying to kill. I, I thought it was my kid. No, 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 no. Never mind. So, murder scheme gains progress. I still only got 76% success chance. I don't trust that. But yeah, if it's only 76, then I'm gonna take a look. If I can... Uh, can't be convinced. How much would it cost to, to bribe you into this? 250? No. No, 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 no. What if I put my spy master back to... Uh... Yeah, support my schemes. How much would it be then? 
94. Now we're talking. Now we're talking. Okay, that's great. I'm so sorry, Raymond. I'm so sorry. It's firmly my grip with the right strategy of my smurf. Intrigue lifestyle experience. Intrigue challenge against Kant. 96% secret fabricated. Okay, 96%. That, does, that doesn't sound bad. No incredible. Okay. The false rumors have been ba What? Seriously? Did I just get the 4%? We just got the four percent on a ninety-six percent chance. Oh, great! <laughs> Seriously. Oh well. So uh, ninety-five, ninety-five. This is fine. An extra. Uh, can I imprison him for that because he's a fornicator now or, or something like that? 95. I am so sorry, Raymond. Raymond is dead. Aww. I gain stress, but I don't care. We were all doing this for the grandkids. All doing this for the grandkids, right? So, now it's Agnes who's in line. So let's murder them and yes. And yes, I'm so sorry, and yes. 59, that's not a hell of a lot. Hmm, but oh well, we'll I, I, I don't care if I have to bribe people to actually get into this. How are you liking it? Where did you not see it on, on Friday, Salar? Basically what we whoever is coming late. What we try to do is we, we are creating our own dynasty as Matilda of Tuscany who starts airless and uh, without a hobby at, in the start of 1066. Um, I didn't want to do the tutorial. This seemed like a, a way better and more interesting start for new players. So what I did, I always told the story about uh, EE4, that how I learned it is just set yourself a goal, a really hard one, and then try learning the game to achieve that goal and what i was like because i saw in lombardy that the main air was lustful uh we actually romanced him he became our soulmates and uh we invited him and his wife to court murdered his wife <laughs> and then married him and now my, my main guy my uh air uh my main kiddo from Duke Wolf is actually in line to inherit the inherent title of uh, Lombardy and we killed off all the other heirs to keep Lombardy whole. That's what we've achieved so far. Now my greedy fingers are into Savoy next, into Savoy next, and then maybe Provence and then maybe God knows what. We'll see. So I'm d doing a Skullduggery start. What we also did is fire everybody on the console and fire and get like really good people from abroad to inst to get all my uh, positions filled, young ones, and uh, oh, that's basically what we're trying to do. Yeah, the intrigue. Um, I don't know if I should be swaying the. Em Who else would be great to have on your side? Should I be swaying my own console? They're not too unhappy. So who else? Who else is actually uh, a good target to always improve relations with? The Duchy of Amelia. Yeah, that's something I, I don't understand quite well either. It costs money, but yeah. Swaying on any unhappy vassals, then the Pope is generally the order. Any unhappy vassals. Okay. So basically, powerful vassals who, ex who expect countless positions. Yeah, he's at plus 16. So that's fine then, right? Plus 17 and plus 7. So if they're in the positive, it's okay, I suppose, right? Well, let's do the Pope then, I guess. Uh, 
Base for locked and sizable treasury, I'm already wealthy, blah blah blah. Ah, uh, no. No, 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 no. Do the Pope always free for money? Yeah, we went on... We, somebody told me Friday to always go on, on, on a pilgrimage to Jerusalem at the start. Because then the Pope loves you and always... Uh, well, swaying? No. No, 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 no. I know what we were going to do. Skulldug our way into... Yeah. I'm going to romance this guy. So I'll sway him. He's the primary heir. So there. Whatever. Anything else that I could be do looking at? Yeah, wait a minute. Do we have claims on anything or anybody? How do you see what claims you got? Schemes. Uh, there, oh, man. Is anybody... Oh, wait. Do you mind this game needs work? Ugh. Why is it so unclear, all these tabs? Why... Oh, my God. Click on the character under the titles. Claims are on characters, not the candy. Yeah, but... How do I see what I got a claim on? Ah, over here. County of Parma, County of... Yeah, but wait, that's all in my terrain already, I think. That's all in my terrain already. I got no claims outside of my land, then. Okay, sure. Unless I'm look, I, I want to start absorbing Pisa, Ravenna, and Kona, Urbino into my land. Uh, let me check it. Yeah, no, we can't. We can't do it. We got no claims on anybody. Okay. Sure. Ah, wars that can be declared. Ah, okay, chat. Thank you. Capua, Puglia, Swabia, Lombardy, Ancona. Ancona? Ah, okay, sure. Can Vitalis claims? Woo -hoo 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 -hoo. I would absorb. Yeah, sure. Okay, sure, I I'll declare that. Vastly inferior. Ah, uh, sure. Do it. Somebody, somebody told me last time, Outwigs, do some wars! So here we are, chat. War! Ah. <laughs> uh, Okay. Wait, what? Oh, that's this is turning the camera. I didn't know that. Who's the commander now? Ah, uh, a son. Oh well, that's not good. If I die, I gotta give the other one also something, right? But now we got a son. I might actually be able to marry him off without abducting... Oh, come on, how do you stop this turning? Jeez. You can always disinherit the sun. Yeah, but I would want to let the sun make another sun who is in line to a title first, right? My ruler is young. I can use suns to get my greedy fingers on, on, on something. Like Cecilia over here. If I can marry off... Oh wait, she already has somebody betrothed. Well, derp. Hmm. What about Apulia? Can I marry off the kid to... Uh, oh my god, he has seven children! Seven! You're kidding me. Oh well, I'll romance you after I kill off my hobby, don't care. So, who else could I, could I marry the kid into? What about France? Primary heir, Prince Arnold of France. Do you have any daughters? Yeah, Princess Agnes of France. Okay. Would you accept... Oh, she already has a spouse. Well, derp. Yeah, what about Croatia? Wait, the wife is a... Uh, daughter? Daughter. Okay. 
He's she's betrothed. She is not. Okay, can I arrange a marriage with you? Well, I'll be damned. Look at that chat. So if I marry off this guy to her, then kill off her brother, let her take the throne, create a kid, and because it's uh, be because it's it'll be my yeah okay. This looks like a really good idea. Marry off the second uh, son we have into uh, the daughter, and then kill off her son. He's fifty-seven, so yeah, this is us. Go ahead. I'm just following my gut here. And we got an alliance. Woo! -hoo! What Byzantium declare on Croatia now? <laughs> <laughs> I should not think so. I really shouldn't. Anyways, what are our schemes now? Murder Agnes, okay. Oh shoot, that's only 34. What the hell? It was 95 the other one. Why is it why is it someone Oh well. Refuses refu Oh my god. 34 and, and 49 secrecy is really low. And I can't actually get anybody into the uh into the Oh this is not good, man. I I thought we could actually uh Hmm Hmm. If I cancel it, though, I think there's there's gonna be another timer on it. Ah, uh, well, the other kiddo is not that old yet. We don't we don't need to do this fast, fast, fast. Sway them, yeah, but it's four months, chat. And 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 all of these people don't have high success chance, or well, maybe Gersvinda, that's twenty one. But but even then it would only be fifty. Hmm. Well, I could write the names down, sway them all. When the murder ends, you can choose to restart. Yeah, but what if it, if I get framed? What if they found out that I was that that it was me? Oh, well, fine. So, uh, you're telling me to sway s somebody that would add... Well, sure. Why not? Sway her then. Do not attempt to murder. Ah, okay, okay, okay. Gotcha. Don't get caught. Yeah, but... but ah. Fine, chat. Fine. Anyways, let's focus on the war, shall we? Oh, shoot! He's sieging up my capital. Can I gun the Kanasa increased? Okay, sure. So how long is this uh, gonna be? Maximum two months? Maximum five months. We got time. We got time. I'm gonna get his capital before... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, news to around. I'm checking it. I'm checking it. I finally got enough. One little bribe. Lose all... No. Okay. And then press claim... Have I built anything on the capital? No, because I wanted to get Rome as new capital. But I don't know if I can do it fast, fast, fast now. But yeah, I haven't really delved into buildings. Uh, um, where is that even? I suppose cities? Yeah, I wanted to snatch Rome. Six hundred years. Building a new city. Yeah, but city, even if I move the capital, this is always a good idea, right? But how do you decide? As a feudal rule, you may not personally hold city holdings. You will have to grant a holding to somebody after the construction. What? Wrong type of holding. As a feudal ruler, you may not personally hold city holding. Click on the castle all the way to the left. Okay. This is my castle holding. Yeah, then what? 
Construct new building. Oh, okay, gotcha. Huh, I never really, I never even found this one. Okay, chat. Which, which is a, which is good investment? Let's delve into this part of the game then. What is always something? If you want to do a skull duggery, not too much war. Let's marry everybody on thrones and then kill off all the other heirs. What, what basically, if you don't war all the time, what, what should you be building? Wall and towers for the capital is great to defend it. Thanks, chat. Okay. Wait, what? Holding under siege. Yeah, but... but don't! Can you pin this window? <laughs> I can't die. Uh. You gain 100 intrigue. Or I spend 75. Come on. I spend 75. Oh well. Wait, what? Minus one. Oh, come on. Seriously. It said five months. I don't get it. Yeah, that's load game then. I don't want to. What? At my first war, I get captured. Well, that's just great. So you cannot trust the icon for five months? Is that it? Yeah, okay, did a big. I, I get that, but why did it say five months and two months on me, and why did he get it first? I'll load the game for that. Fast wars during capture. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I, I get what I get what happened, chat. But why did it say five months to two months? I thought I could trust that. Starvation and stuff. Uh, oh well. Can I just? Uh, Pretend it never happened? Yeah, but this is uh, January 2077, man. Oh, I'm gonna lose the title now, am I? Oh well, so now what happens? If I... Can I break free? Now what? Yeah, but... Check my decisions? Oh, Salar, please don't yell. I'm escape from prison. Attempt to escape prison. I did see that you... No bars will hold me? Ah, you did say it before. Yeah, then tag me, please. The success of my attempt depends on the promise and my traits. Oh, okay, sure. Freedom! Ha! <laughs> okay. Not bad then. Not bad. So now I just get my capital back, I take it? Council invitation. I'm the position of chancellor. Okay, sure. Uh, wait a minute. I should get. I should get a command. I don't really want to fight. Yeah, I want somebody that sees FaceTime. I'm gonna. I'm gonna install this guy. They have my daughter imprisoned. Uh, do they? Oh yeah, you're right. Well, if I win the war, it doesn't matter, right? Or should I run some Marat immediately? Is that what you're trying to tell me? No, because they're at war. Where is the enemy? Ah, he's actually fighting over there. Well, then I'm just gonna kick his ass, man. Kick his ass. No. What? How is he? Okay, never mind. We got him. Let's try capturing the ruler. No? Okay. Wait, what? No, no, no! That's not what I wanted. Uh. What? Should I go? Should I go? Oh, for the love of God, man, why is this I, I just want to. Okay, solve this. Sod bloody this. Toggle the outliner, I'm tired of it. Select it that way.
Where's he going? Hey, pregnant. Where the hell is he going, man? I don't know if I should be following the, uh... Okay. Plus 77. Why is it plus 77 all of a sudden? Whatever. I suppose we'll get my uh, capital back and it'll be it'll be 100, right? Oh, I did capture the mayor. Wait, can I not enforce the mans then? Will not accept. Oh, okay, it's probably because he has my capital also then. Do you always capture the leader if you stack wipe somebody? Yeah, is that how it works? Ah, uh, you gain, you, you gain understand people, understands people. What exactly does that do? Scheme resistance. Oh, well. oh come on! You failed to convince. I've been missing out on a 96, on a 78, and on an 80 something already. Seriously. Level up. A daughter. Okay. We'll call her Solar. Nice female name, right? I have quite the impressive gathering from children. I gain modern many children. General opinion of for everybody plus five. Okay, sure. Oh, my mother died. Uh, okay, I don't care about the cat. Not control forensic. How do I only have 93 now? Okay. Seems like we need... Uh, I don't think... In, in like a couple of months I would get 100, right? But oh well, we'll siege. It'll be faster, I think. Health in mind. A private garden. Wait, what? I gained the trade herbalist for 20%. It's a learning chance. Seeker of knowledge. What does that do? Learning plus one. I gained seeker of knowledge. Not bad, man. Not bad. Okay. Winning the war. Oh yeah, shoot! I didn't. I don't think I actually made. Ah, fudge. Uh, I I suppose we'll do Urbino next. Yeah, I forgot to actually fabricate a claim. Wait, that's is that mercenaries? A brewing troublemaker. D the big is actually. Okay, so D the big becomes uh, rowdy. Martial Intrigue. That's bad. That's great. That's great. I like Intrigue. 100%. Okay. Excuse my vassal Mariana of actually... She is a powerful vassal who has a lowered opinion of you. Okay. So I can imprison her and revoke the titles then, right? Force demands. Woo! -hoo. Uh, how do you see your prison? What tab is that? Prison. That's realm tab. I'm assuming. Succession domain. Is it military then? Holy orders, mercy. <laughs> For the love of God, where is it? Ah, why is prisoners under court? <laughs> Whatever. Uh, negotiates release. 
Uh, why can I not revoke the titles? Hmm. Right clicker, I'm trying. You don't have the con authority to do it? No, oh, so, uh, what then? I'm just blind? How do you see that I don't have the... Ah, oh, damn, revoke title. Yeah, but... Oh, man. My kingdom for a mod that makes all these gray, black, uh, gray on black ones colorful. I don't see this. I can barely see this, this font. Jesus H. Christ, why is this always gray on gray? Ugh. That is just stupid. I have a valid reason, blah blah blah. I don't have the limited crown authority or better. Okay. So I suppose we release her for a hook? That's not our I didn't say it was. Gain a weak hook, I suppose? Loses all the claims on all the titles? Sure. Will not accept. Reluctant to give hook. She will lose the claims. Ah. Uh, well, that'll rot in prison then, I guess. What about you? Ransom for 100 bucks? Sure. What about you? Those are from the last war, right? For a favor. Oh, well, fine, whatever. Ah, uh, what were we doing in three guys? Nothing! Oh my god. She has a claim on Orvieto. Do I even own that? Ah, uh, it didn't show up in here. Not that I can see. Oh well. Primary air is and yes. Uh mm. Yeah, that's what I thought. See so if you cancel a murder scheme you can actually not redo it. But um So wait, if I want future people, let, let me focus on this one. This is something that I've been wondering also. If I want to kill off Agnes de Savoie here, then how can I know in these tabs who to get a hook on or who to abduct or who whatever to get a favor on to join a future scheme? In your list of things you do, you can change accounts contract so you can use taxes or levies. Okay, sure. Fine, we'll do that then. Sounds like something that I can agree with. Modify feudal contract. Okay, uh, high taxes then I suppose. You check their line of succession. It's the seven. It's not worth pissing off vassals for higher taxes. Yeah, but... <laughs> An act of tyranny? Oh, you like to piss off cans? Yeah, but minus 15? No, uh, okay. Uh, I'm getting horribly confused, chat, if you're starting arguing with, uh, with whatever the hell I'm supposed to do. Anyways, uh, so we got... We won one war. That's not bad. In the 7, you have a hook on account. In the 7? Ah, you mean on the... Yeah, okay. In the seven? At the top? What? No, I don't understand what you're on about. Seven at the top? Where? What? <laughs> yeah, sorry that I'm a noob chat. Issues. Ah, this one. Yeah, 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 you have a hook on the count. 
You can change Khan Vitalis contract. Ah, okay. That one you mean. The current feudal contract and you want me to go high. Is that it? Well, I could do it. But it's an act of tyranny. So what am I supposed to do then? Ah, you use your weak hook. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, gotcha. Oh, well, fine. Chat says it. Then do it. Right. Why waste the hook on that? Because chat tells me to do it. So, uh, uh, uh. Don't give bad advice then. I thought... I, oh, well, never mind. So you're telling me it's it's a bad... Uh, <laughs> so you're telling me it's a bad idea to use a hook on that? I don't know. You tell me. <laughs> oh, well, never mind. I was trying to look at this here. So, how are you supposed to know who will actually join... Uh, how are you supposed to know when you're trying to murder which people will actually join as an agent without starting it? I would want to fabricate hooks on people to murder this person. <sighs> but I just don't know how to do it. Uh, family... Pff, I just don't know. Is it even possible? I think I'm just gonna murder off my... my uh, I think I'm just gonna murder off my hobby and then go and... and, and, and while I can still make kids marry uh, Apulia. And seduce uh, the main heir of, of Apulia. He's 21. He'll have me. Sure. So I'll just kill my, kill off my hobby. I'm sorry, hobby. So that my kid actually is uh, the one in line for the... Uh... The one in line for the... Uh... Yeah, wait a minute. No. Wait, 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 wait. No, his father didn't die yet. <laughs> no, that won't work then. Let me take another look at this. So, uh, where was it again? Succession one? Where did you see it again? God darn it. Uh, oh, come on. I found it earlier on. How do you see the succession lines? If I marry off him, then it'll likely go to this person. So, oh, well, I think I think he just has to die. He's 69, he'll die. Sure. So, it'll be fine. He first has to inherit the title before I kill him off, right? Just click on the title in question. Ah, okay, chat. Click on the title in... Ah, okay. Right. Um, claimants 4... Ah, this is the line of succession. Okay, gotcha. So he's second in line then. So if I marry him off... Yeah, if I'm seeing it right, if I marry off my hobby, my heir becomes next in line, right? So I can make, kill off my hobby now, and, 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 and when this guy dies, the title will pass on to Didabig, right? If the heir dies, it goes to me. But yeah, won't, won't Lombardy get partitioned then to the other son also? Chat? I don't want it. I don't want it to actually be. Uh, I don't want it to be divided when when the uh, guy dies. Oh, for the love of God! This is complicated. This part of the game, man. And line of succession. Alberto Azo of Ta Ah, wait! Wait, 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 wait! What? Now this guy has to die first, and then my hobby. If I'm looking at it, yeah, yeah. This guy has to die first. If I want to inherit, if I want to grant, if Lombardy is uh, is gonna stay whole, then this guy needs to die. Then my hobby needs to die. Otherwise, it'll get partitioned, right? 
Yeah, I I'm pretty sure I'm right about that, but, but gee, is this complicated. Anyways, I think I'll go for uh, this one also now. Because I need high crown authority in the end to actually change my succession law to uh, thingamajigger, right? Matri, whatever. Time to write another PU guide? Yeah, I guess so. This is not a bad idea to do, right, chat? Rules can change between partition succession. I need high pretty sure to actually get the... Uh, If you get level 2, you can take the titles? Titles can be revoked. What? Yeah, but revoked is not the same as usurping the title, right? Oh, there. So now I can only do it in like 1099. Alright, so it's 20 years in between. Once we got that, I'm pretty sure I can change it to... Uh, uh, I think I looked at it at this over the weekend. Yeah, we need high crown authority. Okay, and we need prima prima thingamajigger. Prima genitor is twelve hundred earliest. Really now? Uh. Oh well, but I need somebody to marry or, or whatever. Well, I could fabricate a hook. I could kill off him. I, I need to kill off both, right? She's only 13 years old? Ah, that's the problem. I No, I can't kill him off, because otherwise if it goes to her, then uh, the first kid in line, if she gets married, will actually... Oh, man. This is complicated, trying to steal titles. It really is. Let me take a look at you. I was gonna do something with you also. Um, I think we were gonna abduct Chofred, wasn't it? And then force him uh, at our court and then marry him off to my daughter? I think that was something we... Yeah, that's something we chat so... So, abduct. Chofred will soon be my prisoner. Then recruit him to court, and then make him marry my daughter matrilineally, and, and... Oh well. It's only 34% chance, though. Oh, is this even worth it, then? But if... Yeah, so abducting, you can actually enforce him to, uh, to accept matrilineal marriage, right, chat? This seems worth it, then. If I can marry off a daughter to him, then it'll be fine. So, can I, can I invite anybody into this scheme for cheap? 34 seems, uh... 34 seems a bit... Yeah, but 300 bucks! Jesus H... Jesus H Christ. How much would I need for you? Only 50. Now we're talking. Refuses my... So I need 3. So if I gift her... There. And then bribe her. It'll work, right? Okay, that's a cheap one. Uh, oh, wait a minute. <laughs> 26, yeah, that won't work. Can't be convinced. Ah, 300 bucks, I don't want to do 300 bucks. But I might have to. If, if it gives me the title of Provence in the end of the entire duchy, then this is worth it, right? Would you folks agree that it is worth it to actually... How much do I need for you? 170? Hmm. Oh well. Just do it. Why the ransoms? <laughs> okay. So 64, that's still not good enough. I don't like it. Available perks. Uh, can I get 
Murder scheme power plus 30%. Oh yeah, please. That's great. Uh, yeah, but I was looking at the current ones. And I think... Oh, Duke Alberti of Lombardy died, chat. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. So my hobby is now... Next in line. Wait, what? Why did it still get partitioned? Huh? Oh, for the love of God, I don't understand this. He was the primary heir. Did he actually make a kid before? He, I think he made a kid still. Oh, for the love of God, I didn't check that. He got a kid still and Genoa and, and it got partitioned. But can I ward this now to, to press the claim of my hobby or something? Count and sell most claims? Um, doesn't my hubby have a claim to the title? So he's ruling that one now, right? Yeah. So wait, who's in line? Ah, so I could kill the kid. I could kill the kid and he inherits it. Well, that's better then. That's better then. Okay, fine, we'll kill off the kid. <laughs> this is fine. <laughs> this is fine. Right, uh, let me take a look at the other one. 62. I don't like it, man. It needs to be higher. Hmm. Refuses 27. I, I, I cannot. But why can this guy be convinced at 40 minus 42? And this guy at minus 27 not? I don't get that one either. Is it because they actually are corruptible? Hmm. Three hundred bucks, Jesus H Christ! Oh well. And I suppose we'll do whatever our chat was saying on the uh, building tab. Construct a new holding there. And somebody said that walls and towers are great, right? So let's do it. Ninety-two is good enough, I suppose. Hobby is not in the court. I get he's not in the court because he became ruler now. I get that. A highway attack. 82. Oh well. Please? Escaped? Oh, for the love of God, seriously? Ends your scheme. Restarts at 0%. Aww, uh, seriously? Yeah, but wait. Is he... If he's watchful... Hostile scheme resistance plus 5. Oh, well, do it again. I, I've been getting like... Nope, nope, nope on all the 80% balls so far. God darn it. Oh yeah, by the way, Ricardo could use an air, right? He's uh, betrothed to Croatia. So can I install uh, somebody... Can you give... Can you give a, two wards to somebody? Yeah, you can. So if he's grooming two of my uh, male kids. Well, sure. Why not? Send a proposal. Is it always best to groom the wards? Ah, uh, the, the, the males and not the females? Oh well. Anyways, uh, intrigue 82. Whatever. Is there anything else I need to do now? Council? Yeah, two months for Urbino. You should do both? Depends on the succession now. Yeah, but. Okay, fair enough, chat. So I want to pin you. He's three years old. He'll never make an heir. I'll just kill the. I'll just kill the kid. Not sure. 
secret tunnel. It might be a bit outdated, but we gain progress. Sure. With the best teachers? Yeah, Salar. We, we found a uh, a 20 plus steward lady with, with meters touched. And I married her off to one of my uh, one of my knights. And she's grooming both of my kids. Grand city of Urbino. Okay. Go to war! Kick ass! My claims gain the contested titles vastly inferior. Go! So Solar or anybody else, if you think that I'm doing something really, really bad, or if I should be doing something, then by all means do tell me. Do not let the capital be seized. Yeah, I learned my lesson on that one, trust me. I will probably win. Okay, yeah, but I want the... Uh, a knight in the army. Okay. Martial skill. Ah, uh, but yeah, shouldn't I be shouldn't I be getting the the engineer? This is a ford. It crosses water without. Oh well, it really doesn't matter. Thirty percent. Wait, what? How is how is he escaping? And now he's actually gotcha. Let's hope we capture the ruler immediately. So if I now follow him and and wipe him out, wait, what? Where is he going? How can he... Where the hell is he running off to? I don't get this. <laughs> I don't get this one. Why is he retreating to my capital? What? Where are you going? Um, I don't understand how he... How does the rotting mechanic work in this game, I wonder? Oh, come on, seriously. Catch him. Get out of here. Probably win. Capture him, please! Oh. How does stack wiping even work in this bloody game? I think I'm just gonna... Uh, I'm, just, I'm just gonna siege it, I think. I don't get it. So now he's retreating back to his... to your Bino. <laughs> I will win decisively. No, oh, well, I don't think I understand the battle completely, uh, the battle mechanics yet. Faction created against me. Oh, that doesn't sound good. Uh, no. What was that? What? Ah, shoot, I think I clicked it away. Where do you see the factions created against you? Once lower crown authority. Oh, so because I increased... Too weak to send an ultimatum. One member. Who the hell is it? Count Alberto of Parma. Okay. Uh... He seems wounded overnight. 
Can I do anything to, uh... What can you do to get this guy out of the fight? I could murder him, but... Meh. I, yeah, we're still busy with an offensive, uh... So what can you do to get people out of, uh... Is it because of my military power? Is that it? Or maybe I should sway him. No, oh, let's sway him then. Why not? I could also give him some land, but eh. Don't feel like it. Make him a consulate? Nah, we got... We, we got the best... Uh, we, we got a really good console chance. You saw me do that, right? Anyways, let's check our... Uh, yeah, abducting is now 95. Gotcha. So, imprison them. So now what do you gotta do, chat? So now what do you gotta do to make him accept the marriage? Uh, he, he's not... Wait a minute. I'm getting uh, a wee bit confused here. He has he has no betrothed yet, so how do you do it? Is it negotiate release? Gain a weak hook? So do I need to take the hook? He must be an adult to recruit. Oh! So you're telling me I need to leave... I, I, I think you, I need to let him be in the dungeon for a while? Is that what you're trying to tell? Okay, well... Fine. I'm so sorry, kiddo, but now you're dead. Thirty-two percent. I'm gonna have to pay. If he lives, he gets a wife. Okay, I mean, if he lives to 15, then I recruit him to court and then give him a wife. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why is it only so low? Predicted agents. Oh, here it shows. Okay, 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 okay. Ah, uh, 37 seems really, really lowish, man. Hmm. But oh well. Did I start it or not? I could hire some more people. I want my hobby to get it. 88? Oh my god, yeah, okay, fine. I'll I'll pay whatever he wants then. <laughs> sure, 95%. <laughs> well, I love this part of the game, man. Just kill off everybody to secure titles for your grandchildren. I like it. This part of the game I really like. But anyways, let's uh, focus on the war over here. I like it. I didn't. I, I don't think the rest of the game is gonna interest me. If if I'm gonna play CK3, I'm gonna be the aggressive marry uh, abductor. This basically the intrigue lifestyle is uh, really great. Okay, chap. Uh, is there anything else in your capital that you should be constructing? Uh. So we had the. Uh, let me see, tax, levies, levies, barracks, military camps, levies plus 100, uh, farms and fields. So basically this repays itself in 300 months. Tax plus 05 a month. Uh -huh, so in 300 months, so basically in like 25 years, more or less, it repays itself. Do these farms and fields stay forever, chat? Should I spend my money on this or on something else? Please advise. I would be grateful. I would be grateful. Uh, 
Okie doke. And, uh... So now let my... Yeah, wait a minute. What are the issues? Low county control in Urbino. Okay, uh, I'm pretty sure we could let... Uh... You do something about that, right? Yeah, increase country control in Urbino. What? Why doesn't this work? No, not a valid target due to nothing. What? Oh, it's likely because I didn't grant it. Yeah, but wait a minute. It was somebody's claim, was it not? Ah. Uh... How do I know which one? Who had a claim on it? I'm pretty sure we did a. Ah, no, wait, that was Ancona, I think. Scratching my head here. Does it really matter then who I give it to? I think so. Oh man, this part of the game. Like, like what to assign to what vassal and whatnot? I don't know. So it says, uh, let your vassals rule over some of the domain by granting titles. Well, should I give it to the guys who don't have land yet, chat? Or maybe to the guy that was actually creating the... Uh, the faction against me. I could do that also, right? So who was that again? Ah, uh, let me see. That was you, Alberto of Parma. But he's already a powerful guy. Should I actually grant him the title then and to get him off my back? Let me check. Yeah, it will work. For the opinion of me for 50 years. He remains a vassal and he remains reduced below... The faction that Khan or Britta belongs to loses some discontent. Okay, find it. There. Okay, what other issues do we got? Disbanded. Ah, the, it got disbanded. So we, we actually uh, did something right then. Ransom Dauphin. Yeah, wait a minute. No. I don't want to ransom him. He needs to uh, be 15. Oh, Pisa we could also declare. Oh, okay, sure. Whoops. Whoops! Totally forgot to declare on Pisa. I'm a derp. So, is there really no aggressive expansion? Like, any fork? Can you just make claims? Whoever invite claimants? And nobody really cares? That's so weird. Six twenty, okay. Uh sure. Go kick his ass then. Well, I will probably win, but he's defend defending in the hills. Oh well. I will probably win, you say. Okay, sure. I'll take that battle then. So what does this all mean? Advantage seventeen in the enemy's favor. Enemy's damage ooh is increased by thirty four percent. It seemed like it was a bad idea then. Unless we can actually capture the guy. The spy master? Wait, how do we capture a spy master in a battle? Ah, because he was a vassal, I think. Yeah, something like that. Wait, what? How is that battle not triggering here? Never mind. Um, 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 what? Oh, yeah, that's the, uh, that's, uh, the one from Genoa, right? Yeah, okay, L let me check it. Yeah, primary air. 
Okay. Yoink. He's dead. I'm so sorry. Oh, I gained stress out of that. Yeah. Ugh. I don't know. I don't know. Can you host the feast still? But why am I getting the stress? Oh, well, because I'm getting the... You gotta say I like it. Hi there, Magnus Life. It's far from perfect. Well, I don't know. I think so far from what I've seen, it has no major bugs and it's great. What I've been told, Magnus Life, is that if you really want to delve into the Crusader King series, it's good to learn the basics in CK3. But if you want to really delve into the advanced stuff of it, then you should be going to CK2. Because the content in CK3 will not interest you for more than a week or two. That's what I've been told. Anyways, um... Uh, how much does this cost? Oh, come on! Can I really not throw a party? How much? You lose 39 stress. Okay, gotcha. But, oh. 100 bucks. Um, how bad is gaining critical stress chat? I gain critical, so I, I'm likely gonna go to the first level of stress. Is it worth it then to pay 100 bucks to host a feast to just avoid it? And then declaring war. Oh yeah, yeah, but Magnus life. Isn't that part start already? Oh well. So we, we can do this. We can do this one. And reduce the stress immediately and then kill the kid, right? Game. Uh, can I select you? Uh, oh, come on, I need to. I need to see how much stress he has. Uh, never mind. So, you gain 48 stress. Okay, so now we don't have critical stress anymore. Nice. Feast begins, but let's maybe focus on the war, shall we? Ah. Uh, Gain 70. Okay, not bad. I really. Disaster strikes? What? The wine has gone bad. But I drink the moody shirt to dwindle like at the cruel pace. Oh no! Matilda says. Uh, 75. Every guest gains 10 opinion of me. Time to crack open my secret stores. I gain fought the thirst. To supply my guests with enough to drink at the job of any host. Well, sure. The option is available. Oh, so this is the green option like in FTL then. Because I'm the eager blah blah blah. I can crack open. Right. So, where did he... Did I stack wipe him? I stack wiped him, I think. Nice. <laughs> Um, who do we kill off next then? So Lombardy is once again whole, that's why we killed the kid. So now kill off the hobby, and then romance this guy. Right? Right. This is fine. What we'll, we'll cur the 95% chance! 95% chance to kill my hobby. Okay. I'm 36, I could still get a kid with the other guy and inherit the title in the end. Okay, so. This is fine. Uh, any issues now? Any more issues? You can usurp the anointed kingdom of Romania. Really now? Wait, the anointed, so it's part of the Pope. Inherited according to Pope. It would cost me 500 bucks. Yeah, wait a minute. Uh, yeah, never mind. L l let's just enforce the demands first. I'm a bit busy. Here. And uh, now what? Titles can be created. 
Like, is this worth it, chat? I think I'm in line for the kingdom title of Italy now if I uh, inherit Lombardy, right? Oh well, did I assign my console to... No. So what do we make claim on? Uh, that one? Um, 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 um. Yeah, Ravenna. Okay. Sure. Ravenna. What? It has been discovered! Seriously. How am I doing? Oh, I'm doing fine. The Wiccan was great. And whatnot. This... Wiccan was great. Thanks for asking. So there, uh, think, 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 think. Just know, once you get both kingdom titles, that's when you get two sons taking two songs, two sons. You mean taking two major titles? Now, I, I'm pretty sure I can gain Italy title if I inherit Lombardy. I think I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna buy the title of. Uh, Romania then. Right? I'm not entirely sure what you're on about, Olifa. You can leave one kingdom unclaimed, then it can gradually absorb one into the other. Okay, sure. Right, um, we also had a kid in, in the dungeon. <laughs> can you, like, pin somebody so that you get the... Uh, can I pin the guy so that he actually... That I know when he comes of age? Oh my god, I got plenty people in jail. Jesus Christ. Yeah, uh, get them all out. Don't care. Yeah, that's the guy. You, right? In house arrest? Oh, he's 15 already. Yeah, wait a minute. When is a character considered, uh... Is it 15 or is it... Or is it 16? Oh my god. I got so many people. Sixteen. Okay, sure. Right. Uh, everybody, go home. Ah, shoot, yeah, we need to give that to somebody. So, random, uh, okay. Um, do we still have powerful... Just pause the game, damn it! I don't even know what we were on about. The game has a knack of actually uh, continuing above the main limit. Yeah, we we're gonna address that. Hostile scheme suggestion. Oh yeah, baby. Now we're talking. And uh, yeah, count of Parma. He's at plus one hundred, so that's fine. Plus 45 and minus 17. So I'm gonna give her the title of uh, whatever it was. What was it? Ancona, right? Was it Urbino? Urbino, I think. Um, wait, what did I just conquer? One recently acquired holding causes no penalties yet. County of Pisa. Ah, that was it. Okay, gotcha. So, Pisa, eh? County of Pisa. Okay, sure. Yeah, exactly. It's it's not fun. Oh, man. Whatever. Any other uh, issues that we... Go away! <laughs> Any other issues? Not really. 
Accept console positions. I don't care. Oh, uh, yeah, give me my monies, Mr. Pope Man. Thank you. Prisoners can be right. Wait, I still got two prisoners? Oh, I thought we, we got everybody out. Matilda Ziani, who the hell are you? Ten bucks, okay. So he needs to be 16, right? Okay, let's pin him. And I think uh, I, went, I, I think I'm gonna save the game here for once already. Duchess Matilda there. <laughs> I don't think we're doing that bad. Hope you folks can agree. My agent at Duke Wealth Court has been... Ah, oh, for the love of God. Ah... Uh, it's no longer... Darn it. Yeah, okay, this is an important scheme now. It's still 95% chance. That is so weird. Oh well. So basically now, if I kill off my, my hobby, my child inherits the title of Lombardy. Right? Yeah, Didabig will inherit. So yeah, Didabig, you're about to actually see the goal we had from the start of the game. Didabig is in line to inherit entire Lombardy now. I'm so sorry, husband. It's, 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 yeah. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry! Duke Wolf is dead, beaten trampled by his own subject. The agitated peasant went wild seeing their leads riding through the streets and tore both him and several of his knights from their mounts, beating them to death. Many peasants were hanged, including my agitators, so they cannot be traced back. I like it, man. I can. I like it, man. I can. I don't like it, man. <laughs> Why do I hear myself all of a sudden? Ah, uh, trying to fix it. Trying to fix it. <laughs> what the fudge? <laughs> Never mind. Continue. So, now what? Yeah? Okay. So now my, my main heir is ruling over Lombardy. Um, but wait a minute, I need to play as him? So if I die now, he inherits Tuscany entirely, right? Go on a pull image. Sure. Go to Jerusalem again. Let me check that. Uh, oh, come on, for the love of God, stop bothering me. Heir in line to inherit titles. Oh, what? I'm first in line for the Duchy of Corsica and the County of Genoa. Ah, oh, wait, no, he needs to create a kid. Yeah, wait a minute. Why are you not in line to inherit Tuscany? Yeah, I'm trying to uh, understand this this succession system, man. But yes, yeah. so the Duchy of Tuscany, right? Yeah, did the biggest first in line. Okay, sure. Did the biggest first in line. When you die, you get it. Yeah. So if if now Mrs. Matilda dies, then then my my son would inherit all of it, right? Okay. Well, time for a new hobby, I guess. So this guy is the main heir of uh, the big kingdom of Apulia. So let's 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 go, let's go. Let let's go do naughty stuff with him. And then kill off his wife. 
then marry him matrilineally, and my kid will inherit. <laughs> I like this part of the game. So yeah, sure, a romance him. Zero percent! Come on! Hmm... So what if I kill off his wife first? Cynical dislikes Zealous and what? Oh, he's like the, the exact opposite of me. Okay, who's next in line then? Uh, wait a minute. Who's next in line? Roger. Okay, well. Are you betrothed? Yeah, shoot. Hmm. How would you want to be all 64? Oh, wait, no, that was the wrong one. Roger, he's not attracted to women. Okay, sure. This is getting interesting. So, you then, Guy, and then kill off the other two? I would have to... Wait, you're married to a 51-year-old? Oh, maybe I should check if... The, yeah, but I, I'm just a wee bit afraid that the Byzantines will take over entire Italy if I don't get my greedy fingers on Apulia soon. And I don't want that. Oh, but he has seven children. I would have to kill off, like... Uh, I would have to kill off these two guys in order to actually make sure that I inhabit that uh no oh well so is this worth it the king is actually 68 so i would say yes so if he would actually i would have to kill three people in order to get uh any of my children matrilineally on the throne in apulia hmm. does he want it zero percent what the hell Oh well, it doesn't seem like I can do it. What about befriending then? Possibly making him my lover. Now that won't work either then. No. Oh shoot man. It doesn't look... well. Should I focus on a pull you next? Hmm. If I want to do some... Uh, I think Croatia we got our greedy fingers on already, right? No, we don't. Wait, what? Sway is always a first step. Well, not all the time. Wait, I could have sworn I did something in Croatia also. Uh, I suppose we could kill off his, her spouse. And then marry her. We already got children, so eh. Mm. What is the basic chance to do this? Seventy percent. I don't know. But yeah, would you accept to? Uh, what about abducting them? Can I kill off one of the wives? I've done abduct any. Can you like abduct the primary heir? And then, uh, like we are doing with Provence, and then marry him, chat? If I kill off his wife first? If I kill off his, this guy's wife, and then abduct him? Can I recruit him to the court and then uh, marry him matrilineally? I suppose we can, right? A bit like we were doing with Provence. Do it. 57%. Oh, fine. I guess you can. Yeah, I hope you folks like my playstyle in this game. I'm intrigued. I'm intrigued by the intrigue, pun intended. It's complicated to, to think on the long term with this type of playstyle, but it's working. 
It's working. You gain the trait ill. He may remarry before you abduct him. Yeah, but Nuster, if he loses his wife, won't he want to marry to me? If won't he be more uh it's dependent on the traits. I gained the train ill uh, yeah. Phew <laughs> Not ill. He may remarry yeah. Um I lose stress, yeah sure. I can lose some trust. Abduct first, kill second, marry third. Ah, shoot. Yeah, but I can't switch it out now anymore, right? Ah, crud. I can't switch it out anymore, Rolanson, because there would be a... C can I still do it? What is the timer to actually... Can I still cancel this? But I, I think if you abandon it, then I get 10 years before I can do it again. He is the Duke, it's too late. Wait, what? Did he die? Oh, fudge. Oh, come on. Oh, well, Sicily then. Oh, well, we'll cancel it then. I think we'll go for Sicily then. The Sicilian ruler has, uh... Yeah, Sicily then. I don't want Byzantines to get their greedy fingers on this, man. We can manually conquer this also. Okay, fine. So, because he died... The Duke of Sicily, okay. Uh, you can't, yeah, but I could murder him and he will get it back, chat. If I murder uh, the Sicilian ruler before he gets a kid with, with his wife, then it'll go back to Duke Buhemann of Apulia and, and, and then we could still continue this. And then a I know we can't abduct him anymore. Shoot. Okay, recompute. Uh, married the, one of my sons t to her? Do we still have a son to marry off? No. Well, crud. <laughs> nope. I need sons, please! God darn it. Is there any way you can actually... Yeah, but... What I'm wondering, Nooster, is will, will he be more open to a, a relation with bad trait, with opposing trait people, if I actually kill his wife? Still, we could still go through with it. And then marry him, and then kill off his brother in Sicily. Oh, man, thinking about all this is just... Yeah. But I don't know exactly how it would work. I could marry myself to him, but I don't know if he would want to. So do we just... I think I'm just going to let the scheme continue and see what happens. 140... Oh, well, don't care. We'll just do it. Not bad. Piety. So what claim were we making? Ravenna. To be on. Wait, why did Corsica now split off? <laughs> and so. Yeah, but that's my son. Oh, okay. So Corsica is under our control now. So in the end, the goal of the game is just to spread your dynasty all over the joint, right? Is it like a dynasty map mode? Gift which is Khan Joffrey. Happens. Scheme suggests I'm plus ten percent. Dismissed it. Oh. Oh yeah, the guy in my prisons. Ah, 
Uh, he should be 16 already now, right? Yep. So, uh, I, I, I'll, I'll uh, save the game again because I don't know how this one works exactly. In the plus above the shield, there is dynasty, government, and death map modes. But yeah, the, the idea is to install rulers of your dynasty everywhere, right? It's not... Like, I, I want to roleplay only the sun. This one? Dynasty, government... I don't see dynasty. Additional modes? What? Rounds? I, I don't see... Uh, huh. Now, how do you see dynasty map mode, then? Uh, maybe I might not be able to do it because I'm still a subject to the king and to the holy woman emperor, right? Oh, well. Never mind. Never mind. This is working. False in blah blah blah. Yeah, uh, we were going on the kid. Ah, uh, kid. So, ransom, negotiate, release. So, negotiate, release, recruit. I take it then. Forcibly recruited and gain a weak hook. Okay. And then marry him, right? And then uh, make him marry. So now I can use the weak hook to make him marry matrilineally to one of my uh, daughters, right? I'll just try it out. Okay. Sure. And now... Uh, Ah, wait, but I can't do it because his father is, uh... Oh, wait, 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 but because he's in my court, it might actually work then. How old is the guy? 16. Uh, what's my oldest daughter? Matilda. Okay, Matilda then. Matrilineal marriage? Wait, what? Oh, so because he's at the court, he will accept it. Oh, I'll be damned. Matilda married Joffrey. Ah, oh, wait. My daughter was already 16, so they got married already. I oh, know, it's just betrothed. Okay. Forced marriage. This is great, man. I really like this. So we just enforced the marriage on the heir of Provence. And their, ch their firstborn male will be, in, will be of my dynasty, and I'll, I'll control it with my dynasty, Provence. Nice. Okay, who's next? On the uh, l let's let's enforce people stuff down their throat they don't want. Uh, what were we doing still? Ah, uh, murder the duchess, right? Sway the count. Ah. Uh... Okay, it seems like Hungary is crazy big. Can I do? Can you do something to kingdoms if you're not a kingdom yet? Primary heir. Not betrothed. Okay, can I arrange a marriage with uh with me? I don't have sons, god darn it. We got daughters of plenty, but no sons. So he looks pretty wounded and in ill health. Princess Sultana Make more babies, yeah. Uh, I think. Is there yeah, yeah, I'll make more babies. I know, right? Does France have like only uh, a male heir? He's twenty-nine. Hmm. Prince Baudouin. Okay, are you married? Yes, you are. Hmm. Nah, too old. The stuff will split when you die, so if you have a bunch of sons, it's gonna split hot. Yeah, but no, no, sir. No, no. The idea would be marry them off, the sons, let them create a baby, and then disinherit them. As, as dynasty head, I can disinherit them, right? The baby will still have the claim on the throne, but I can disinherit the son just to avoid my realm splintering, right? Or did I misunderstand the mechanic? That's what I had in mind, really. Okay. Let's 
see it done. So that's Ravenna done and not, and now we can go for Balanya. If you form the Kingdom of Italy, that's only one Kingdom tier tile. Yeah, that's that's uh Okay, chat. Yeah, but I, I still don't quite understand what needs to happen to form Italy. My, I basically think I gotta die, but, but I, I cannot form the Kingdom of Italy before my my uh before Matilda dies, right? Oh, where was that again? I need to directly control stuff for that. Now, Kingdom Italy, top. Kingdom Italy, that's what we're after. I want the uh, Kingdom of Italy title so that my realm doesn't split anymore. That's 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 how it works, right? Check the map modes. Uh, Duchy titles, Kingdom titles. I want the title of Italy. And... Uh, we need 15 required counties. Yeah, so basically if I die, if uh, Matilda dies, then my son will get control of entire uh, everything, right? I'm also looking at Romagna here, but that is a bit... Yes. But Romagna is not going to help me out, right? How many years do we have? I think two? Two sons. Two sons. Ricardo and uh, Didabig. Need counties. Yeah, 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 chat. D I know that one. But our son is in line to inherit Lombardy. Our son is in line to inherit Lombardy now. Well, he's a... He oh. th so, so, thinking about all this makes my head spin, man. Romania can help you out if it's the only kingdom title I can claim. But yeah, but Romania, most of my land over here is not in Romania, right? So it's not safe from the kingdom of Corsica air, right? The Duchy of Corsica will be independent. Oh, well, I still think forming Italy is a good idea. So this guy, my son, is, is the next character we're going to play if Matilda is... Uh, is uh, down and out, but he needs, he needs his mother in Tuscany dying, and then it'll all go to him, right? Forming Romania is hard because of the Pope. Ah, uh, it said that I could claim the title. You can usurp the anointed kingdom of Romania because I got most of the land in it. So, is this a good idea, Chai? Should I just usurp it? Does it help to actually avoid splitting my land up? I'm not entirely sure what usurping does. I think my country will change from Tuscany into Romania, right? I'm pretty sure that the, if I usurp the title, then it becomes the main title of the nation. And then you just form Romania, right? But does it help in, in the succession news? So that is something that I wanted to uh, to know about. Because, yeah, Ricardo over here is, a, is next in line to Princess Marijuana. Marijuana? <laughs> no, I, I just read that as Marijuana. So the daughter of King Kresimir. Okay, yeah, so they're betrothed. That's what we were uh, doing with that. Oh... Yeah, so I need to kill you off. Oh my god, I almost forgot that. Abandon the scheme, murder that... Yeah, I need... Can anybody remind me to... Be, oh shoot, and he's already 64. I need to kill off the air there, man. He may be a bit put out. They would just kick his ass. Get Rome also while we're at it. Who's with me? Who's bloody with me? In the meantime, I'll just do some more war. Where are 
are you going? He's actually a military engineer, okay. What? Oh, come on. So the scheme got discovered. I'm a bit busy with schemes. Oh well, 66. Can I still invite somebody for cheap? I don't think this is worth it then. 95. Oh well, fine. That'll have to do. Ah, uh, wait a minute. I will probably win, you say. Okay. Come on. Oh, did it just say no immediate effects? Oh, it's still 66. Cut down it. Oh well. Whatever. So where are you going now? Over there? There. What? How is he running away again? It's happening again. How the fudge are they able to do that? Nineteen percent that the scheme is discovered. Oh well, I'll take my chances. Nice! It worked. Ah, uh, yeah, while we're at it, uh, the plan, yeah, I, I, I need to focus on my uh, skullduggery first. So you, would you marry now with me? But yeah, it needs to be matrilineal. He will accept, but matrilineal he will not. So I need to make him my lover, otherwise it won't work. Can we do that? Can I romance him now? It still says zero percent. Ah, so killing off his wife means nothing. It's basically he, because he dislikes zealous and he dislikes calm and he doesn't like us. So I cannot force him into matrilineal. That there is just no way. It was kind of wasted money then to kill his wife. Shoot. Hmm. <laughs> abduct? Yeah, but abducting... I don't... I think somebody said in chat that abducting, that you can't actually recruit him to court. Because he's a ruler, and because he's a ruler, you can't actually force matrilineal down his throat. I think the only way that I found out so far is to make him your lover and your soulmate. Right? And then it works. You can abduct for a hook. Yeah, but a hook, even with a hook, you won't accept matrilineal, right? I think... I think I would need a strong... Would a strong hook actually work? I think strong hook when it comes to accepting marriages is only like 200 reasons to do it. For the heir? Yeah, but we don't have a kid to marry off to him. Oh, well. Before I forget it, she needs to die. Because I'm married to her, marijuana. I'm so sorry. We'll just do that and uh, invite some people in, I suppose. Can be uh, Boris can, uh, for 19. 84! Oh yeah, sure. That's worth it then. To get the Kingdom of Croatia. I'll pay some money for that. Thank you very much. And let's focus on the war. Uh, 
Uh, where is he going? Uh, what? Where is that arrow even? Ah, there. The scheme gains power. Oh man, I, I should just go sieging. Darn it. I'll probably win. Ah, defending in mountains. Yes. Yeah. Lambert claim. Oh, he's getting Corsica back. My mate, did a big you're getting Corsica back. Not bad, bro. You're the, the the first kid while we were romancing uh, with seas of the uh, seas of the wrong dynasty, really. Sad face. Wait, wait, wait! No, 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 no! Oh, don't tell me that. Oh, for the love of God. Seriously. <laughs> Face bomb. I married the wrong... The, he died before I could murder his... Uh... <sighs> Fudge, man. King Cressimir died before I could kill off his daughter. I should have done it sooner. No, yeah, well, he's looking very weak. Yeah, but I suppose I could kill off my wife now and just marry. Ah, uh, can you also? Um, could I actually end the? Ah, oh, for the love of God! I, I had some relation with Croatia. I, I think my, you were actually married. I'm getting a bit confused here. What was my relation again with Croatia? Ah, uh, oh yeah, the sibling, Marijuana. She's married off to... Uh, yeah, to Ricardo. The guy that did a big just kicked his ass on. So, can I still... Can I still rectify this? If I kill the heir... And then the mother, it'll go to... Yeah, okay, let me check this. <laughs> Don't care. We're just gonna keep on murdering. Yeah, so if I kill this kid... If I kill the kid, then it then it goes to uh, Swayfred. So I need to kill two people. Okay, sure. I'm so sorry. 92. Murder Queen Nida. Wait a minute, what? No, 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 no. Yeah, wait a minute, that's actually not half bad. If we kill her, it'll go to him? And then we could just kill the kid? And it'll go, yeah, okay, fine. That's fine. God, can this be confusing sometimes? I'm killing her, yeah, so, so it's fine, it's fine. Right? Oh, the love of God. Um, am I not fighting him? Oh, yeah. Okay, captured him. Not bad. Let's go get the war goal. Hope you like uh, Mrs. Skull Dugging. Uh, Mrs. Skull Duggery uh, Matilda. Uh, how are you folks feeling about me? Plus 100, plus 100, plus 25. Oh well, sweet you did. Well, I suppose I could still try my best with the. Uh, 
with the king of Apulia, but... Even if I kill his, uh, even if I kill his spouse again, he'll never agree to marry me. We got opposite traits, so, eh. I could take a look at Cecilia. Is Sicily in line? Some way, somehow? Yeah, Duke Guy of Sicily is like the third or the fourth in line. If I kill three people, then Duke Guy of Sicily. Ah, wait, no. Dark... No, 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 wait a minute. Ah, so if, if you don't make a, a son... This is just so complicated, the succession. If you don't make a son in time before I kill off... Okay. Oh, you got a son, eh? I could wait 15 years and abduct him and then, uh... I could wait 15 years, abduct him and then marry him off to one of my, uh... One of my daughters matrilineally. I don't know if I want to wait that fast. Duke Roger... Would you want... How are we liking each other? He's not attracted to women. <laughs> Matilda for sale. Who wants to bang Matilda? Um. Oh, let, let, let's let's see. Prince Arnulf, would you want it? If I kill, uh, could I? Would it be possible to take over the kingdom of France this way, or the kingdom of Hungary? Let me check the situation. She's thirty-four. Okay, what if I... Yeah, but he has way too many children, right? Does he have a son already? Yeah. Yeah. Hmm... Okay, France seems easier to do. Well, then again... I would... How would you like to, uh... Be romanced by me? 95%. Then kill off his wife. Uh, but they got two sons, so France will be split up, right? Well, what do you folks think? Do we go for France? It's on. It might work. If I romance him, then kill uh, the spouse of uh, Arnulf of France, and then kill his brother, then my ch grandchildren would be in line to inherit France, right? Hmm. Not sure. Or could I also... Uh Yeah, wait a minute, no. What it I could also abduct him, then kill his wife, recruit him to the court, and then marry him off to uh me. That also works, right? So I don't really need to romance him, I think. If you just abduct him, that it all that but yeah, we got ninety-five to actually Ah <sighs> thinking of this is sometimes really hard. So romance him, kill his wife. Do you want the whole France? Yes, I want the whole France. Did the big? <laughs> Why not? So ro a bit like we did it on Lombardy. So if I romance him, and then kill off his brother, uh, getting the whole HRE. How can you get the whole HRE? The HRE is an elective title, is it not? How could you get the H3 if you're a vassal of the H3? Did, did a big that that sounds a bit weird. But oh well. I, I'm just gonna do it, I think. Uh because it seems like we yeah. Gluttonous life we, we are really a match made in heaven. Look at this. 
Glutton is likes eager reveler, and Zealous like Zealous, and my like my rank is lower. You need the perk and still you to claim the throne on your lead. No, uh, no, the, the big I got time. The the plan is to just let this guy. Oh wait, I need to check if he has airs already. No. Uh, oh, it's a grandson. Ah, oh, shoot, he has two children already. Uh, I would have to marry. I would have to kill too many people for France, man. Because, yeah, these children are in line to actually... So I would have to kill off his wife. Kill. I would have to kill too many people, I think. Now, what, what about what about Hungary or something, then? Let me check it out. Wait, why is Princess the heir and not the son? Ah, they got too many children for this to work also. But oh well. But you're saying that I can actually go for the Holy Ro I don't get it. Prince Heinrich of the Holy Roman Empire? But I thought it was... So you're telling me I can do this? He does not have any children yet. How would you like to be romanced by me? 100%. You just need to abduct him? I don't get it, man. Well, what would abduct him? And then marry him... Yeah. And then marry him uh, matrilineally? Is that what you... I, I don't think I get what you mean. Uh, you would need a perk for... Yeah, but not, I don't want to do it with Claim of Throne. We are doing Intrigue lifestyle. I'm not going to go stewardship. Sorry. If I want to make it so that my children of this with this guy are next in line, would, would I inherit the HRE with my grandkid? I thought it was elective title. I thought it was an elective title, so... If I would romance this guy, uh, if I would abduct this guy, invite him to my court, and then marry him, would my, would our kids actually be first in line for the HRE throne? <laughs> I don't know, you tell me. I thought it was just an elective title. But romancing also would work if I kill his betrothed, right? Check the title. Okay. Duke Gottfried of Lower Lorraine? Ah, who's that? It's selective, so yeah, I, I, get, getting it doesn't work then, did a big the way I want to do it then, right? It doesn't work, I think. Oh well, I'll try it with France because why not? Why not? We only have to kill five or six people in order to make it work. <laughs> it would work with the claim thrown only. Okay, gotcha. I'm still gonna do this. I don't care if I gotta kill off everybody, I don't care. It's worth the money. If we can inherit France, this is fine. So, romance. Uh, wait a minute. No, I just need to abduct him, right? Uh, what was the plan with France again? I think it was first abduct him and then kill off the wife and then release him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Abduct Arnulf? Can I do that? 57% chance. And I'm from Flanders here. Van Vlaanderen is actually uh, my homeland. So yeah, if I if I capture him and then kill off his wife... 
Oh, but we're still murdering Queen Needy, man. I could... God darn it! I could do... Yeah, the, wait, the romance... I could... I can romance him and, and kill off his wife at the same time, right? Uh, so this will take... How long? 19 months. How long would it take? How long would it take to actually kill you? 11 months. Okay. So... If I if I understand this, oh wait, but we're still killing Murder Queen Nita. Oh shoot! Oh, oops. Oh well. Let, let's do that first then. Oh man, Skullduggery. What can I say? Control Ravenna. I just focus on our wars. What about Byzantium? Don't make me look at Byzantium. Don't make me do it. Escaped unharmed. Come on. Uh, you got an attempted murder secret? Oh, for the love of God, man. Hmm. I could do it again, but I kind of want to do France first. She can wait, right? But yeah, then I can't do it again anymore. Oh. So now it's still 92, right? I suppose we don't need France immediately. But he will die. He's 55 already. At least it wasn't discovered. Yeah, but now somebody might discover it, right? Okay, 100%. Let's do it. As soon as you get a mail, you won't be able to do that in the tomb. What? County of Bologna, 15 days left. Okay. Oh, we're conquering some nice stuff here. Right. Uh now what? Probably what?
Right, anything else? <sighs> um, so we were still doing the Intrigue, yeah, 92, fine. Usurp the uh, thingamajigger. Ransom? Wait, what? If we still have people in our dungeon? Okay. Ah, four prisoners. <laughs> Ten bucks, wow. Uh, by the way, why don't I have any music? Oh, there is music, it's just not very loud, it seems. Hmm. I'm still trying to think about that entire friend. Do I romance him or... I, I think the idea was to make sure that I, that I kill his wife at the exact same time that I finish the romance. Yeah, that was it, right? I, I hope I hope it'll it'll work. Oh, I could do it already now. The only thing that matters is that it might become his dynasty if if if, if Matilda gets pregnant. Oh, she's already forty, man. Oh, I don't know if if I could still father if she could still uh, bear child. What was my plan with Savoy again? Ah, <laughs> oh, yeah, 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 wait a minute. Didabig is married to uh, Astashi. So, I, oh man, I need to take a look. I got so many stuff that I take. Savoy still needs to be fixed also. Savoy still needs to be fixed. Yeah, 13. In a couple of years, he needs to die because if he makes a. So yeah, wait a minute, no. He's sterile. Minus 50%. Okay. Well, I, I, I got so much skullduggery to do. So Provence. We, th these married to our Dharam. Yeah, the main heir is married to... Uh... Okay. So uh, we still need to work on Savoy. We still need to work on Savoy. Yeah, do it. Okay. So, Croatia, let me see. Uh, wait, what? Who the hell are you? Father of King... Wait, what? And I... It seems like we miss under... Uh, Ilfern, Margaret, Sh Wait, why is she not in line anymore? Wait a minute. I'm a bit, uh... A bit confused here. I thought we had something regarding... I could have sworn we had somebody married into Croatia. What was it again? Something marijuana. So why is he not in line? Yeah, that's what I thought. But but where is she now? The second daughter. Ah, oh, for the love of God! So I think I think killing off the Keen was a bad idea. Hmm. Oh, oh well. It's mostly their heirs now. Yeah. So I I I misunderstood the line of succession here, then. Didn't I? Ah, oh, for the love of God. Well, I could, I could marry him now. But yeah, 
Or could I marry him to one of my daughter's matrilineal non? Would that work? I don't think so. Plus eight. Uh, for matrilineal it doesn't work. So I could abduct him, right? I could abduct him and then force him to marry, uh... Force him to marry, uh... One of my children matrilineally and then... Hmm... I don't know if I should focus on Croatia still. I think, uh, France is way... Well, I don't know. Wait a minute, I could marry... I could marry him also. His wife died. <laughs> nah, nah, that's not... Never mind. So, if I focus on this person, I, I could... Yeah, wait a minute. I think what we wanted to do is murder you for 11 months. Yeah, so first I need to sway romance him for 8 months, right? Let me check this again. I could romance him and then abduct his wife, and then kill off his wife, and the moment his wife dies, if the plot succeeds... So this was 19 months, eh? So if I start this now, romance him, lay with him, then kill off his wife, then he would agree to marry me matrilingually, thingamajigger, right? Or do I do it with, with abducting? Hmm. I can't do two schemes at once yet. The problem is they got two kids already, man. These two. I would have to kill off the two kids also, right? Ugh, that's like three three people I need to kill <laughs> to get next in line for the throne of uh, France with one of my grandkids. It's far-fetched, but I think it's not that bad to do. If I can... Ah, oh, wait, 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 wait. We also had to do... Uh... That can wait, I guess, but Savoy needs doing also. Yeah. Savoy needs doing also. We married off somebody to Savoy. I, I would. I, w I need to secure the throne in here be with, with Skullduggery before I actually. Uh, basically, I need to make a stashy. The uh, yeah. I need to kill off Aeneas first. Let's do it. I cannot do it until 1078. Oh, well, fine. Watch me forget it. Watch me forget it. No, 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 no. That's not, not that. Romance. Okay, so now in July... I, I need to do this in February. Go with the gut. So, when it says 11 months, I need to start abducting the wife, right? A killing off the wife. How long does it take usually before they get re-betrothed? Ah, uh, oh, wait a minute. Don't I need to invite him to the court first? How did I do it in Lombardy again? Ah, uh, I'm trying to think here. I think in Lombardy we first romanced him, and because we romanced him, he will come to my court, right? I think that's how it went. So should I start killing? Should I should I go for his wife already then? Hmm. 11 months. Would he remarry in 11? Uh, I think I think we gotta wait a bit. You got him and your wife in the court. Oh! Yeah, and if I if I bring him to court... Yeah, yeah, then, then we need to wait on the... Uh, we need to wait on killing the wife then until at least February or so. Gains a special gift? Yeah, it was 100%, right? Chat? Uh, did, I think we got 100% to romance him, right? 
Why does it not say so? Oh, come on, game. Yeah, 95%, so I, I don't really do any... I need to do anything. Prince Philippe gets a wee cook? No. Just compliment his taste. So, uh, and... and uh, Oh shoot, and I won my water and I totally not looking at it. Oops. Right, and give the title to oh, I don't know. Maybe I should give it to one of my council ones. Well, they're all very happy to be in my I suppose we keep on giving it to the powerful vassals, right? So that they don't rise up against me. 47, 77. Oh, well, Count Vitalik, you can have it then. Grand title of... Uh, Olanya. Okay. Do we have any other wars I totally forgot? Capua, I don't know about Capua. Where is even Capua? Ah, there. Okay, sure. Ah. Uh... Wait, 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 wait. That's not what I wanted. Ah, Puglia would actually protect him. Uh, I don't want to fight a Puglia for it, I think. Hmm. Can't be at war all the time. I need some money. Yeah, you have more troops. Yeah, but, but did a big up. Uh, I don't know. I would want to marry. You just need to see it's two counties and it's 100%. So you would do it, you say. Okay. Yeah, but it's only Capua. You think this is worth it? They don't have money for mercenaries? Where do you see that? Oh, if you say it's worth it, then we'll do it. Yeah, seats two counties. Do I actually? Uh, do I? What, what? So what do I siege up first now? The war goal or, or uh, uh, the other one? Damn. Uh, is it once again? Is it still the? Uh, is is it still the, uh, the sieging guy? No, I want the sieging guy to siege it. Thank you very much. Anyways, okay. Uh, do I need to start on the wife now? Okay, let me let me see. So eleven months, eh? Yeah. And then sink. Sink it in such a way. Yeah, I'm murdering. And that's also gonna be 11 months. Okay. Yoink. Uh, can I invite somebody in that would that would help? Yeah, Stalio. Uh, and I'm enjoying the Skullduggery. I really am. Truce with Prince, Prince Bishop Gaspar ends? Who the hell is Prince Bishop Gaspar again? Ah, wait, that's the guy. That's this guy, right? You're 30 minutes in my stream and you like my style? Yeah, in E4 in the other game, I focused on writing a marriage guide for the PU mechanic. I, I think 
marrying and seducing into all nations is a way more effective way. Was it the Pope? No, I'm pretty sure it was this guy. Gaspar of Constantino. No, it's not. Do not have a gas is blind. Nope. Was it the Pope? Was it enough? I haven't fought the Pope before, so how? Who the hell was it? How can you see? <laughs> I want to reread that. I don't, I don't know who it was, chat. Sorry. Guess I'm an idiot. <laughs> These guys I don't need to be afraid of. Okay. Um, poetry is not my... We got 100% on this, so I don't really need to do poetic nonsense or whatnot. So, <laughs> nine months, eight months. Okie dokie. Move to the dungeon? What? I don't want to have dread. Huh? No, I don't know. I don't want to do that. No, thank you not. Wait, what? They're fighting me? Um, okay. If you want to fight me, then sure. <laughs> and we'll just uh, siege up that, and it's and it's. Uh, oh wait, no, Napoli. So, five months, five months, we're gonna bang this guy, the heir to the throne in France, and we're gonna kill his wife at the same time. Very, this is totally not suspicious. Totally not. I'm not from Vlaanderen against, yeah, fire lies. Uh, the scheme gains act of heroism. Act of heroism? Schemes for Chacha, I don't need that. I'll just take the opinion. Thank you very much. 100%. Okay. Right. Uh, any other wars we can do? And I totally forgot. The Pope. Wait, I can declare on Apulia yet again? He's the, the duchy. Always check the factions menu. They can split you apart. It's the factions menu. Why would you want me to check the factions menu? We, we are pleasing all the vassals who want a council position with land. So I don't think any faction will actually uh, rise up against me. That's a good tip. Uh, Apulia. Oh well, we, uh, instead of marrying into there, I suppose we could just... So... Okay. Can Vitalis claim is that? Barony of Lunciana will... Hmm. What is best then, to declare the jour or to declare for somebody's claims? This is 37, 300 and... Ah, oh, the jour is better. Ah. Seize the county. Yeah, but wait. What? Is this more land than the other one? Declaring for the duchy is more expensive. Yeah, but ah, uh, okay. So basically, the county. Oh, well, fine. Let's get the war goal. Okay. 
I go ahead and win my attempt. So how is it sinking now? Two months and ready. Okay, go ahead with my attempt to romance the heir to the throne in France. Wait, what? He throws himself into my arms. Thank God you're here, Matilda! Yes! I lay with Arnold van Vlaanderen. Uh, okay. You go, Matilda. Let's hope that there's still a chance for a baby here. Um, wait, can I invite into my court already now? Wait, what? Uh, how did I do it last time then? I can't do it. Or do I just need to wait a little bit? You'd have to do the second day? No, we did for Lombardy, we did the first one. Okay, so now the, now the female is dead. Right, uh, I use my soulmate. Now I think he will accept matrilineal, right? No? What? Why not? I, how did I do it with Lombardy then? I don't get it. I really don't. I think I need to abduct him now. Right? Right. Okie dokie. Invite somebody for 20. Okie dokie. Let's hope this works. I'm with child. I can't even know not yet. It's too early. It's too early. Uh-uh. Darn it. He will be of uh, his dynasty. That's not good. That's not good. Shoot. You can call on my ally, Princess Marijuana. Croatia. What? My ally? Uh, oh yeah, and I'm once again uh, over the limit here. So powerful vassals. Uh, who hates me the most? They all don't like. They don't. They all don't care. So should, should I now begin to actually hand out titles to my uh, council members? Chat. We got no disgruntled powerful vassals anymore. If they are powerful, they will ex they will appear over here, right? So should I now start be begin? Well, I, I give something to Gerald over there, or anybody else? Oh wait, the count is also a powerful vassal. Uh okay, I'll hand it to him then. Can I give the title to the heir? I don't know. No, I can't. Need to give it to him. No, well, I give it to my marshal then. Why not? Grant a title of Capo. Right, and uh, sure. Oh, not married. God darn it. So yeah, intrigue. Sure. <laughs> abduct, abduct the guy. I just lay with. Because why not? Watch the French king dying now in all rage. <laughs> he needs to survive for a couple more years. Okay. 
Wait, why is Napoli once again? Ah, that's the capital. Never mind. Wait, what? Who the hell are you? No, never mind. I'm just gonna go for his capital. Well... Yeah, but he's standing in the way. That's the problem. I don't know if I want to fight that guy. The chances are even. Eh, I'll just go for that one first then. Unless he goes out of the way. Hmm. Wait, what? Commanded by the ruler, you say? So if I go fight the guy... Yeah, wait a minute. Wait one minute. Never mind. We'll, we'll, we'll just go siege that. How long does this take? Ooh, quite. Hmm. Call house members? Kick the king of Cap by clicking him. Ah, uh, is that him then? Yeah, commander is Duke Jordan. That's not him. Ah, uh, but it says commanded by ruler. I don't get it. He's Bohemond, but it's... Is it this one, then? The Jordan is the Napoli one? Yeah, but... Oh, okay, yeah, but well, what should I be doing, then, chat? Check the rule. Yeah, but I just did that. It doesn't say anything where he is. I, how am I supposed to see that? Located in Larino. Else? Oh. He's in the troops? Yeah, but then why doesn't it say so? Is he in here? Ah, Barony of Larino. Gotcha. Oh well. Let him siege it. I don't want him to get the uh, to get the siege in there, though. Yeah, wait a minute. What? The chances are even. Hmm. He would actually. Thirty-three days left. Shouldn't I just go siege his capital town? I mean, I don't want to fight because this seems sketchy. I, I think I'll just wait for my allies to uh, to do this. Oh wait, he's going on a boat. Really now? Oh well, sure. If you're going on a boat... If he's going on a boat, then I'm just gonna... Wait, what? Uh, that was not my intent, but oh well. Never mind. King Baldwin died, you gotta be kidding me. God darn it, so now what? No, no I didn't say go in there. Oh, fudge. Oh my god. Abduct king. He's not the king. <laughs> 
So my lover is now the king chat. So now what the fuck? Uh, can I just marry him? How do I marry him matrilineally now? If I abduct you, yeah, but if I now abduct him, I can't force him to marry me, right? Yeah, I am abducting him. I am. But is it still gonna work? Why not? You say I don't know. You tell me. Does does the death of the king change anything? Does the death of the king change anything? I don't know. You tell me. Matrilineal? No, it's it still says uh minus nine hundred and eighty two. Well, I don't know. If I capture him, we'll just see. We'll wait for the abduction and then see. My lover King Arnold has, ref has revealed my secret to the world? Oh, great. King Arnold was the new father of Edda di Canasse. I gained the train. So wait, Arnold gains the train fornicator. Wait a minute. So King Arnold is the is the new. Um 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 um. I am a bit of a, a wee bit. So wait. See, it is my dynasty, and his daughter is okay. Um, I'm a bit confused here. So yeah, basically keeping up my 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 thingamajigger. Oh well, never mind. It's just not gonna work. <laughs> it's not gonna work. So, so should I just keep on going with this intrigue chat? I mean, we started it. I could get a. Maybe I can get a hook to actually marry one of his kids. Right? Kidoki. Whatever you haven't even trying to achieve here, that my grandkids inherit France. Some way, somehow. County of Provence? Who the hell are you? Ah, don't need you. No longer... Still 95 though. I didn't even know you could abduct kings like that. I thought it only worked with children. Okay, so my, an event for my spy master. I might gain an intrigue lifestyle perk. Sure. <laughs> gotcha. Uh, good. Uh, okay, so now I gotta take a look at her traits, right? Paranoid, deceitful, to lie and deceive. Uh, she's also diligent. She's enemies in every shadow. So what is this about? If you found, if you walked into a room to find your spouse yelling at a young page, what would you do? Board would have to tell me what happened. I would encourage conversation. She sees enemies in every shadow, and to lie and deceive. 
Uh, option one then, I guess? Or maybe two because he's uh because he's uh inform information is power is that it I suppose that is the second one yeah yeah because she's paranoid they would both have to tell me what happens right let's hope I uh, I'm doing this all right <laughs> so yeah what can I do with you now. Torture him to death why not because he exposed my secret. Execute him. What? <laughs> no. So, um, 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 negotiate release. Gain a weak hook. Demand conversion. I can marry him now, no? For t but I get a weak hook, but it's not going to be enough. So basically, imprisoning him doesn't do a darn thing here. So what do I do with him then? Ransom him off? I, I could ransom him off for 200. For 200. Move him to the dungeon. <laughs> well, let's move the King of France to the dungeon. What could possibly go wrong? Uh, what I could do now, chat, is basically abduct the heir and marry him off to one of my... Uh... Yeah, but I don't have it. That, that's what I was checking. My daughter doesn't appear here. Where is the daughter? Is it her? Yeah, but she's... That wasn't her. <sighs> I don't get it. Let me let me check it. Oh, it is my daughter, but she's of the, she's of the wrong house, chant. She's of the wrong house. He acknowledged the child. So never mind. If I still want this this to work, I could abduct Badawan also now. And then kill off his wife. And then make him marry my... Uh, one of my daughters. And accept it at Matwell Angel. Can you legitimize her? Huh? Uh, no. So if I wanna... Yeah, okay, I, I also th need to take a look at this one. Tinia? What? Agnes. I still need to kill Agnes here. And then I need to kill Duke... For, I don't know with France. What do you folks think? Do we continue messing around with France? <sighs> we got the king in our dungeon now. So if I got him in my dungeon and and him in my and the other guy in my dungeon, he would marry one of my daughters that is unmarried, right? We still got a daughter that is unmarried. Pretty sure. See him I can can marry. Yeah, but shoot, no. Hmm. Is he on the dungeon? He, he's still in prison. That's that's what he is. I didn't do anything yet because I'm uh, I'm a wee bit concerned to do something wrong here. Okay, somebody is uh, giving me uh, advice here. Marry the second son matrilineally and then kill the first. Okay, but I don't know if he would if he would want to do that. Marry the son. Yeah, but he's already betrothed. And I don't have anybody to marry. What, would he marry me if I... So you want me to kill the spouse of the second guy? Right now? Third son? There is no third son. It's only two. Yeah, but if I capture this guy, if I abduct Prince Badawan and kill off his wife, then it would work also, right? Or just abduct him. But then I'd, 
then I would have to marry him. Oh man, this is getting complicated. <laughs> I don't know if this is even a uh, feasible stuff. The last one of the children, that's the Ill Ill illegitimate uh, kid that I made with him. But I, he is of the wrong dynasty, so I can't uh, do anything with her. So how much would it... If I want to abduct him, it's 57. I think the primary heir... If I want to... No, not murder him. Uh, because he's the heir, you got a huge malice for the marriage. Ah, okay, the dirty gem. Yeah, but the, the third one will also not be... Uh, I don't think the third one will actually... So you're telling me to do it with him. Okay, so abduct him. Please spell it out then, because uh, this sometimes is way over my head. He does not have any children yet. He, do he only has... Uh, so I could abduct him, kill her off, and then marry him to uh, one of my... Yeah, that's the problem. I don't have one of a daughter anymore. I would have to do it. I would have to marry the guy myself. And we're already 42. Yeah, but I would need a kid, dirty German. I can only get children up to, to 45, right? Would this even work then? I'm getting a wee bit too old to do it myself, I would say. But I could try it, right? I don't think it's worth it because we're getting too old. But can I like legitimate, legitimize? Nah. Is there any way that I can abduct my kid and make her my dynasty? Can I make Princess Azulia of France actually the heir in what way? I wouldn't know about that one, actually. Uh, can I marry you off to somebody? No, we don't have a... I, I, I think we'll just have to leave France and, and the aggressive marrying alone for a while, chat. I don't think this is going to work. I'm still wondering if I can do something with him in prison. Hmm. Um, could, could I romance him again? By the way? No. Can I romance him again? She would become the... Yeah, but she's not of my dynasty, the dirty Germans. She's not of my dynasty, so that's no good. Right? Could Would I be able to... Uh, Seduce him again? Yeah, he is my soulmate. Uh, I'm still one. So he he just uh, spilled the secret on the floor. You would marry her to somebody of your dynasty. I don't have anybody anymore to marry of my dynasty. That's the problem. Uh, sorry for pausing this long, but I'm just, I, I'm just, what, he, God darn exposed the secret too soon and his father died too, too soon also. Otherwise, this might have worked, but now, I'm just wondering if I let him go, if I can romance him again, be because I'm, uh, can I romance him because he's my soulmate, and then marry him matrilineally? I don't think it's possible because he's the ruler already. Right? Ah, oh, if anybody proficient at this can, can advise me, can I still become in line for the throne of France with the king in the dungeon? I don't think it, there's any way. Uh, from what I've seen from the mechanics so far, I don't think it's on anymore. Hmm. No, oh, well, let's just focus on this one, I guess. So... In the middle of a march to battle, just as you're setting up camp, an officer approaches you to ask what should be done with a spy that has been caught. Enemies in every shadow, lie and deceive. 
Let's not shy away. Mm. We would never... I think that's the correct one. Let's hope so. <laughs> so what were my options to negotiate this release? Just a weak hook. Can I really not invite him to court? <laughs> Offer to join the war. Yeah, what? And your lover's special relation with King Arnulf. Yeah, but... <laughs> Man, I don't know with this anymore. The more I look at it, the, the, the more I'm wondering, wait, what? <sighs> I don't think I... I, I, I could just end my love. But I don't get it. So, he's still my lover then. Or isn't he? It said, end my lovership with him. End my lover's special relation. An ongoing... So it's still ongoing. I think what he did is just expose the secret to the world. He just expo... Yeah, he just... He, he ju what he did is actually admit that Azilia France was born outside of wedlock. Yeah, so if I now kill his wife, would he still marry me? Matrilineally, blah blah blah, because I'm a soulmate. I think soulmate exceeds. Oh, we're just gonna do it. Whatever. Tired of thinking about this. We'll just try it. Whatever. This is fine. I don't care. Kick killer off. You make a decision. Yeah, you. That all taxes in a country will be raised to come to your attention that one of my vassals openly questions that decision. The whole court would hate over the vassals every mistake. Ah, to lie on deceit, diligent, elusive shadow. Confront them loudly. Now oh, well, I think option one. Ah. Oh well. I guess we did it wrong. The affection is gone. Me and King Arnulf are no longer lovers. Oh. Oh well. What can I say? What can I say? Ah, uh, wait a minute. Wait, wait, wait. English war for William de Normandy's claim on the Kingdom of France. Attacking King Arnulf of France. Wait, 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 wait. Why am I in the... Oh, it's for the liege. Yeah, right. Wait, what? Duke Didabig adopted Franconian culture? It changed on... Oh, shoot. So wait a minute, you need to actually find tutors of the same culture, otherwise they change culture? What the hell? Really now? That was not my intent. Oh well, so now we're still unmarried, blah blah blah. Ah, okay. Joffred Bosonid and Matilda di Canasse. Eh? 
Air to Dofa Dofana de Provan. Yeah, okay, sure. I still need to take a look at Savoy also. So basically England is, is, is fighting France. Okay. Wait, what? My king from Haas Flander my, my my daughter is, is, is dead? How did it happen? She has died in house arrest? Ah oh, come on, seriously. Ah, Poor kiddo. Can I just call a hunt? Do I you lose 39 stress because I'm diligent. Oh. And then we don't get stressed out over it anymore. Why would he arrest the kid? Yeah, you tell me. Can Vitale, 30 opinion? Yeah, sure. <laughs> so basically the guy that, that, that exposed that my daughter who died was actually a kid out of wedlock is still in my dungeon. Torture him, he deserves it. Don't make me do it. <laughs> don't make me do it. We're still killing off his wife. I don't know. If I can marry him and see the errors of his ways, then I will still do it, maybe. <laughs> yeah, but we got, a, we got a scheme on the way to kill his wife, chat. Can't do it all at once. Wait, what? Why am I not sieging this? Oh, it's a city, not a not a holding. Gotcha. I got in three points to use. Ah, thank you, chat. Okay. Ha! Huh. Oh, come on. Why do I get stressed for that? Why do I get stressed to kill off the lover, to, to kill off the betrothed of somebody that betrayed me like that? Oh, well, and now, and now I think we got no way of avoiding this anymore. Right? It tells me why? Yeah, because I'm... Oh, well. I don't think I can do anything anymore to, uh... To get rid of the stress, right? Oh well, then I'll, then I'll just have to be very very stressed. Uh, I convert to no. I gain athletic. A diff. Wait, what? So, a different kind of outlet would help. Oh well, sure, let's go athletic. That's really that sounds really really great. That sounds really, really good, man. So basically killing her off was a good idea. So yeah, now what? What is the situation... What is the situation in France now? Let me take a look at this again. Uh, so hey, wanna marry me? He's imprisoned. Oh, come on! Marry me! We'll accept... Ah, oh, man. The primary heir is Prince Bardouin. And, and, oh, well. I, should I just let go of France chat? I mean, we, we got Savoy to, to secure also. I think I'm just going to let him go and, and let the weak... Get the weak hook. And, and hope it's enough to marry him. But I'm, I'm sincerely doubting it. He will never do it matrilineally. There is just no way, Jose. Skill tactician. Oh, recruited him. Ransom. For nine bucks, fine, whatever. And you, I suppose, uh, will release for the weak hook. So 
so many guys in the prison, man. And now marry, marry me, please. <laughs> I, I sincerely doubt he'll accept this. That's <laughs> 48. Because he's marrying down. Oh, crud. What about his heirs? Ah, uh, well. I, I should just let this go, I think. There is no way in hell that he will ever accept uh, matrilineal on any of these, right? I don't think there's any way. Click the user hook? Yeah, but... It's still not enough, Chad. That's the point. I, I could... Well... You want me to get an alliance? Is that it? I, I could marry him for an alliance. I mean, it's not that bad. Right? Um... I don't know if I want to. I don't think this is worth it. Sorry. What I need to do is secure my claim to uh to you. So that so uh Mr. She is married to me, so I need to make her next in line for uh Savoir. I need to kill Agnes and Giro. Okay. Fine, whatever. Pa pam pam pa pam pam pa pam pa pam pa pam. Anybody we can recruit? No, no, okay. But would I marry somebody else for an alliance? Maybe. What about Hungary? Uh, no, forget about it. The primary heir is the Duke of Nitra. Yeah, wait, wait. Doesn't he have any children? He does not have any children. Twenty-one. Hmm. He already has a spouse. Well, do I? I don't need to remarry, right? I'm still considering it. Da -da -da -da. Yeah, well, how is that war going here, by the way? Um, wait, what? Occupied counties? Wait a minute, what? Oh, f how the hell did he... Why didn't I get notified? Seriously? I thought he was just busy, busy rummaging in the side. He occupied my entire nation. Oh, I I'm lucky that I didn't get captured here. I should be uh, kicking his ass trying to capture the ruler. Just marry somebody with good stats. Okay, chat. But who? Not paying attention to the game. Hey, man, I thought I would get notified. I am so sorry. How am I supposed to know? Uh okay. Can I marry somebody with uh, inheritable traits still? In theory, I could still make uh, a kiddo. There's no notifications in the game. Uh, okay, game. Uh, okay, chat. So who would I... What do I... A handsome guy. But what do you say... 
marry somebody with good stats. Somebody that is like... Yeah, but I don't need... I need, need inheritable traits anymore. But how do you find somebody with good stats, on average? Uh... Some of all skills. Thank you, chat. Some of all skills. Okay. Wait, so he is the best? 11, 11, 19, 9, 13. Okay. He's the sweetest guy. Does it really not matter then? Arcaton, Bavarian. It really doesn't matter who you who you uh I, I should look at the trades then, right? He catches on quick. He catches on quick. Uh, should I look at somebody with, with good stats? With good traits? Ah, inheritable. Forget about it. Well, I could still get a kid out of it. Nah. Well, this guy is actually... So the quick one is actually an inheritable trait. Carlsberg. 26 learning for a 71 year old. Yeah, but some of all skills... Is this really more than that? Oh, well, I'll just marry the 29-year-old uh, then. What is it? I'll just marry uh, this guy then. Traits only marry for kids. Okay, 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 fine. There, we'll marry somebody. Oh, for the love of God, man. And now, of course, he is going away again. <sighs> shoot, shoot, shoot. Oh, well, and I really need... I really need to go, chat. So we'll continue this tomorrow, I suppose. But yeah, this... Wh what are my vassals doing? I could have sworn we called in everybody to the war. No, we'll just re-siege all this and, and and do it in the end. Emok is no longer my court physician. What, did she die? Wait, what? Why did you... Ah, she got imprisoned. Gotcha. Oh, well, so let, let me recapitulate. We are uh, doing you. 73, can be convinced. Sure, drive him... Max out like two stacks of seed weaponry. We don't have the money for that. What are my vassals even doing here? The lower right side of my screen? Wait, the Pope is at war with somebody? Oh well. Oh, great. Blood uncovered. I am not gonna get... I am not gonna get Savoy, am I? Nice. Oh, well. We'll just uh, keep on uh, besieging. But yeah, intrigued, then I suppose we do the other one. Ah, uh, she was third in line, right? We'll do a stashi. 
Ah, uh, no, 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 no. Stashi is the one that it, that I need to get in line. So, Gero de Geneva. Okie dokie. Kill him! Can be convinced. Oh, man. This is likely not going to work. Okay, finally. Phew! Can I kill this guy already now? No. Is there anybody I could still declare war on? Uh, yeah, the, the popes seem to be at war. How can I see who is at war with chat? Yeah, he is at war, but he has like 5,000 guys. I'll consider that tomorrow, I suppose. Disband all the armies. Oh, let's go. I don't think we did that bad. But, uh... Does it not say who is he at, who's he at war with? Um, under troop number? Ah, oh, okay. The holy war from the prince as Ah, okay, so he's fighting in a holy war. So I suppose I could do it then. <laughs> No, well, we'll consider that tomorrow, chat. Or should I just declare the war right now? But 5,000 guys? I don't know. He seems like he has a hell of a lot. Similar troops. 600. Yeah, wait a minute. I need Rome. I want Rome. Don't care. 600 devotion, don't care. But yeah, he'll get mercs. It's not the right time, I would say. But yeah, where do you see that he... He has money, so I don't think it's a good idea, man. Oh, well, we'll just save the game and, and consider all this later on. I hope you folks enjoyed it. Matilda is still not dead. So we're all fine and dandy. We're gonna continue securing the... Uh, inheritance of our grandchildren tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoy it. And uh, let's see if anybody is doing something that I can agree with. Pom -pom -pom. Pom -pom 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 -pom. Yeah, see you later chat. I suppose we'll go raid Magnus live. He's the, he's one of the only people I bet that is uh, still doing uh, Eve 4. So yeah, raid Magnus live. Thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed it. And he's doing uh, Byzantium. So uh, that'll be good to raid. Byzantium into HRE. Gotcha. If you don't know uh, Magnus live, he's like an uh, Captain Igloo of Iceland. Likes uh, doing meme campaigns, I guess. So yeah, let's go raiding. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. See you guys later.